How's it going, people? Welcome back to Ay, Matisse. You need to stop logging in as admin, my bro. He just keeps you putting <laughs> you in one position, man. <laughs> I got the keys to the bimmer. Yeah, put put me, you, and Grizz on top, man. Put me, you, and Grizz on top. I and might then need put to those change the locks, bro. How's the Chelsea? How's Chelsea fan got the keys? It's all mad. It's all mad. Mm. Oh, but yeah, dear, how man. is it going, people? It's been a little while. Um, couple of weeks now. Yeah, man. Shit, we got a new member as well. Big up Sakti as well. Listen, update on the pro clubs coming this week, people. Big up the Discord users as well. Um, I know there's been a bit of trouble with the Discord link. We're gonna get that. Well, not sorted out. Um, I'm, it's there, um, but there's instructions to follow to make it work properly. So we just need to get them out, get that out there again. Um, big up everyone that's become a member. Big up everyone over the last two weeks as well, man. Big up everyone over the last two weeks. It's been, it's been quiet in a main show sense, but it's been loud everywhere else regarding the big six. And I say that because we asked people to link up last Friday, and link up last Friday, we did. A lot of people turned out. Big up everyone that did, because I know a lot of you are probably watching now. Um, listen, I was worried. I can't lie to you. I was worried. We, we announced it on Monday. We brought the flyer out on Thursday. Friday morning, it was raining. And I was thinking, oof, this might not turn out too good. Two-man road, four-man road, seven-man was dead. And I see Matisse come over the bridge with about 15 to, to 18 man. And then we knew it was starting to, to heat up a little bit. And in the end, we got, I don't even know how many we got, 50 plus, definitely 50 plus. I, I, counted, I counted 62 at its peak, 62 at its peak. Yeah, oh, come on. Come on, on a working day as well, obviously, um, Jumar as well, which, you know, a lot of the Muslim um, supporters of the show mentioned. Um, we will try and do it on a better day and and a more accessible day um, next time. We're trying to do it in Manchester next time, so hopefully Manchester can turn out like London turned out. And um, we'll get into that when we know what's going on. We're going to focus on getting this content out. Um, the draft video came out earlier today. The content in shortage will be coming out in a couple of weeks, people. Make sure you're hitting the like button on the main show, subscribe and individual channel links in the description below. And yeah, we're back. We're back to business. Games thick and fast from now until the end of the season. No international breaks, no more. Um, no stop gaps. It's, it's all steam ahead now, whether it's a title race or top four race, conference league race. Where we're, we're all here. We're all here. Apart from Tobes. Tobes is away at the moment. Um, bare late notice from him. Um, but to be honest, he did say a little while ago the dates he's not going to be available. But are, we sure? it, are we sure? Is there any... I think there should be a deduction of points because anything, you, you, yeah. Can I mean, no, nah, nah, I'm not in the mood. I'm not in the like. <laughs> <laughs> listen, no, listen bro, this is, this is, you see, after the meetup we had, yeah, I realized mm. this mm. is a humongous show. Mm. This is a gigantic show. Mm. This is this is the big bombastic six, six bro. Mm. And when you're missing, mm. you're meant to replace your. You meant to replace yourself. That's just mm. that's just common courtesy. It's just manners. It's just it's just it's just. Oh, he's just, he's just he's just tweet. He just messaged the group. What do you say? My net stinks. Yeah, we don't care. Yeah. We don't care. Mm. We don't care. <laughs> we don't care. Uh, you know, ladies Fred, and gentlemen, you know, we don't Fred, care. Fred, Fred is a very Fred is a very reliable reliable player in the team in the squad. He always comes on he's and makes the, a massive he's impact. The star yes, to the Basuma every time. You know what? You know what? I'm gonna investigate. I'm gonna investigate. But, there might yeah. be a case. There might I think be a we case. We have a case, guys. Let's so. all work together. As far as I'm aware, together this... forever. Grizz, the Grizz, there's no you. point me and you arguing. We are so far behind that. Like it makes no difference. <laughs> no, no, I don't no, care. no. I want anyone dragged. <laughs> Grizz, Grizz you are getting nowhere near Tobes in that table. So I don't know why you're protesting. <laughs> <laughs> Speak for yourselves, man. Speak for yourselves. Grizz, That's what I know. You, man, he wants it to be more entertaining. There might be something to investigate, Matisse. I'm not. We'll, we'll, we'll go back through yeah. the message. Yeah. Because three point no, deduction. Message in those messages, you'll see me say, and I quote, "Those dates we should lock in through at in advance." Hmm. Now, uh, look. yeah. Well, now look at this. There you go. Here we are. Tobes on trial <laughs> we'll sort that out by, by Monday's show. Um, but listen, we're coming up to five minutes in. There's two point two k in the building. Listen, it's a big weekend coming up. Um, it's Man City versus Arsenal. No introduction needed. Top of the table clash, potential title deciding clash, and all of that. But I want to introduce a new sponsor, and and I'm introducing it like this because I'm proud. We're proud to be associated to. Oh, sorry, nearly fucked up the whole set. We're proud to be associated to to this brand. I mean, not that we're not with Manscaped. They got Manscaped year and a half in now. They're still doing their thing. The code's still there. Still works. But it's a big one because they're associated to the Premier League. They do their thing already. They're, 
the the biggest data provider for the Premier League. You know the name already, people. Um, it's a big, big name in the industry. We're now sponsored by Opta, people. So big up Opta for reaching out. Big up the team over there. Um, like I said, they're the leading provider for the Premier League in terms of data. So it's a big, big thing for us. Um, I think when looking for sponsorship, it makes sense and, and collaborations. It makes sense to align yourselves with brands and and companies that that fit. And I think Opta fits. I think Opta fits. We got a lot of nerds out there. We got Chelsea. We got we got the Gremlin Army. Um, you know, and Opta stats the modern day world. Young supporters, they love it. They love it. So big up Opta. They've hooked up with the big six. And like I said, it's a big, big thing for us. You can sign up using any of the links we provide in the live chat. There's a link in the description as well. And what am I telling you to sign up to? I'm going to get into it now, people. Opta Games. There's a few games there on offer. Free to play. Free to play. I'm going to reiterate that. It's free to play. It's not betting. It's nothing like that. It's a free to play set of games. And again, big, big prizes, crazy prizes, cash prizes. So it's a free to play game. You can win cash. You can win other prizes. You can do it week in, week out. There's jackpot winners, you know, galore across the season. So why not? Why not enter it and why not help support the big six by playing a simple game through Opta? And like I said, a reputable brand, brand as well, not only um, in football, but, you know, across data and all of that as well. Um, what we're going to do here in the big six, I thought to myself, how do we make it more interesting? Because we're going to be playing it week in, week out. We're going to submit teams. We're going to release it on social media. How do we make it more interesting? We already have the prediction table. Week in, week out, we predict games. So what we're going to do is we're also playing, you know, up to five. That's the game we're focusing on. Up to five is the game we're focusing on. And it's exactly like Fantasy Five, a game that I showed you a lot about recently. But up to five, a bit different in a point scoring sense. And I'm going to explain how, people. I'm going to explain how. We're going to pick five players. Actually, you know what? I've got it right here. I've got it right here. There we go. So that's the website. Simple. There's a link there in the live chat. It'll take you directly to here. And you just go through it. It says play now. You click play now. It has a pitch. It has five selections there to make. And it has a set of games across the top. Five games. Similar format to things you've seen before. Very simple. And you just go through the players and decide who you think is going to have a big impact. There's a target rate in there. As you can see here, Sterling's on 85. Not too sure why. But he's on 85. No, you're rude. You're rude. No. Well, it's, it's, well, it's Burnley at home. Okay, fair enough. That's probably right. At home. And heritage tax as well. He was good at City, wasn't he? Um, but Sterling's there. If you want to select Sterling, bang, you put him in there. Sterling selected. If he exceeds his 85 points target, bang on, bang on. You got one pick there. If you get all five, there's a jackpot. It explains it here. There's two thousand dollars up for grabs that rolls over weekly if no one wins it. And you go through the individual games. I might put Solanke here, 90. Looking at this Tottenham one, Suns on mm -hmm. 97. That's all mad. That's all mad. Even Brennan Johnson's on 89. Opta are moving crazy. The stats are saying something that I'm not seeing. Um, <laughs> but you know what? For heritage sake, we're going to put Sun in there. Let's put Musa Diaby in there as well. And Liverpool at home to Brighton. Diaz, he's feeling himself recently. We'll put Diaz in there as well. That's that, That's five picks just off the top there. It's not my five confirmed picks. I'm going to do that with a bit more thought behind it. But once those um, five picks are made, you can confirm there. It says simple confirm my five up to picks. You sign up. ID needed. You do have to be 18 and over. But like I said, it's not betting. It's nothing like that, people. So you can do your thing. Let me just take that off the screen now. Let me bring up. The main pick. Oh, no, it's done. All right, cool. So, yeah, link in the live chat. Link in the description. Lads, how are we linking it to the prediction table? We're going to do this week in, week out. Yeah? We pick five players. Yeah? If we... Let's say if I pick five players and three of them exceed their points target, I get three points. Actually, no, we're not going to do it like that. Sorry. If it, it, What we're going to do is um, if I, you know, get three out of five players right and Matisse gets three out of five players right... Hugh gets two, Saeed and Grizz get one, Tobes gets none. Then we're going to order it like that with the highest scoring person getting four points. Next up, three points. Next up, two points. Next one, someone's going to get nothing and someone's going to get minus one. How is this going to affect the prediction table? Come the end of the season, whoever finishes top of the Opta Fantasy 5 points board will get five points added to their tally on the prediction table uh, okay 
You're giving Grizz a lifeline. Grizz got a chance. Never yeah. finish oh, bottom. Well, now I want to say, whoever finishes bottom of the up to five points board come the end of the season, we'll have minus five points deducted from them. So there's five points up for grabs and five points to lose up for grabs as well. Um, so that's how we're going to link it. It makes it more exciting. Tobes has kind of gone at the top. Grizz has kind of gone at the bottom. You know, we've got to somehow narrow that gap. And it's an opportunity there for for Grizz to to get involved. He said he likes fantasy Premier League. So, you know, it's something that he can get his head around. So it's, it's Tobes worry, already man. deducted five points because he can't play up to five because he's not on the panel and it's only the big five today. Hey, uh, just, to be honest, I've, I've seen him come <laughs> out of nowhere. Go away. Oh, my days. <laughs> Man's on the tube, you know. Look at him in his yeah. shirt, What are you saying, brother? Yeah. Yeah. shirt. I'm good, bro. I'm good. I'm good. I'm good. Pass the toe. Can, can you hear me? Yeah. Yeah. yeah we yeah. just discussed yeah, how many saying. points you're getting deducted. I was. I've been listening backstage. I'm not getting anything deducted. Why? There's no way. There's no why, way. Why? I'm here. I'm here. I'm here. I showed up. I showed up. What you rock it's up here? Twenty two past nine. And you're getting nothing deducted. <laughs> yes. Yes. But I said I. I gave the heads up. I gave the heads up at least a good couple of days ago that I wasn't going to be able to make today's episode. I did say that. I did nope. say. Nope. Nope. What we have to investigate is how much responsibility <laughs> you took on on yeah. replacing yourself and and the, Mate, the process. I, I, I told you, no, 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 we're not doing that. I told you, I told you that I was going to try and get a replacement lined up. My man messaged me today saying he wasn't available to do it, so I don't know what you want me to do. I messaged failure, him. Failure, failure has, has to result in consequences. consequences. So you just you just have a plan A and no plan B. Yeah, failure must yeah, result in consequences. Though. I believe. I don't like that. Yeah, I don't like that. <laughs> Like that, excuse me. Right, listen, I, I, you're lucky. You're lucky. I can't use. I can't use the words that I want to use because <laughs> I've got people around me. But let's just say that there's. Yeah, yeah. That's I want to use that's you, man. That I can't use right now. So it's cool. Good, good. Yeah. I'm glad. I'm say glad you little you bitch, that. man. You're always acting like the big man. Say what you want to say on the train. Say what you want yeah, to say man. on the train. Talk that shirt well, in and speak yeah. your shit, man. <laughs> no time. It's mad. <laughs> Oh, dear. Time, man. Uh, Tobes, you, Tobes, you said you're here, but really you're not here, bro. So you might as well log off and, and get off the train. And yeah, I am here. I am here. I am. 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 I'm gonna listen in, and I'm gonna talk. I'm gonna talk. Ah, cool. We're gonna. We're gonna see. <laughs> man, I see in time recently. Don't worry. Don't worry. <laughs> once, once, once I get, once I get to the airport, and I guess get past security. Nah, no, man. Who no no said that? Who no said that? No problem. <laughs> Who said that, man? Man said Tyrese, you know, it's crazy. I'm calling him tapping tubes. Are you serious? Yeah, I saw that as well. Crazy. Get on to toes, man. Allow him. Allow him. Allow him. This ain't, yeah. this ain't even a tube. It's a, it's a train. It's a train. People need to understand the difference between a train and a, and a tube. Fair. Uh, Fair. Look at it. Like All right, mate. It. All right, smarty pants. <laughs> <laughs> The difference between a train, a tram, and right, a train. You can't even lose yeah. it. Imagine that has got his shirt on. He thinks him, he's all smart and that. Yeah. Let's try and make him lose it on the train and get reported and get arrested. <laughs> oh, dear. Don't be uh, like well, that. Don't be like that. Uh, Tobes is here, people. So hopefully his connection remains as strong as it's looking right now and he can take part in the show. But like I said, big up Opta. The link's there. Opta 5, free to play, cash prizes, other oh. prizes you know supports the big six if you support them they're our sponsor for a little while now um, so make sure you show them some love why not and use that link because they'll know you're coming through the big six big up opta big up opta five um let's let's get into it anyway well what, what is that to there's nothing else to read well jabby alonso news just come in matisse has got his hand up we must we must, we must. 75 percent was the figure i remember wait wait wait, wait. <laughs> that was oh, hey. what have i missed jabby, jabby alonso going to buy jabby me? alonso is staying at leverkusen no um, he's not on the he short was... list told me really yeah he's, no yeah he's not on the short list really? for until it's 100 percent. just as you was wearing your really? NYB wow. jumper i'm now really? taking your itk badge again i'm taking it and i'm giving it to me because i said this months ago you heard it from me first. Xavi Alonso, if you are a smart man, you stay at Bayer Leverkusen one more season and then it is Alain Madrid with Alfonso Davies and Mbappe and Endrick and Vinny nah. and Bellingham and Cameron Matisse. Matisse. 
Matisse, <laughs> Matisse, it's not even Hala Madrid. It's not even it's not even Hala Madrid. It's 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 Danke by Leverkusen and Hallo by Munich. That's what it's gonna be. It's not gonna be no, 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 no. <laughs> <laughs> Because their chairman their chairman be. came out their chairman came out and said the same thing. It would be very difficult to prize away uh, by Alonso from Leverkusen. So both clubs have given him up. Oh, really? So where did your seventy percent come from, mm. man? This ITK card of yours. We need to investigate this. We need to re rethink. The ITK what, what... stuff's still there. I just fake. literally showed you guys what I got. Fake. It's fake. Three fifteen today. It's cards. I, don't know, man. I, I, I just think I Liverpool, Liverpool fans have a habit of getting excited. They start saying things like "Hey Jude," "Hey Casado," "Hey Lavia," "Hey yeah, Shabby." Luckily, I stayed away from. Very few of them seem to end up where they're told hello. Luckily, I stayed away from the "Hey Zabby." I stayed from. And when you tweeted WhatsApp messages. Can't lie, let me check the WhatsApp messages still. Nah, yeah, man. It's easy to do a little search. To be fair, I don't think he, uh, Grizz went as strong on... He didn't go anywhere near as strong, actually, on this one. I, as literally, he did done oh. I literally done a stream with shout out... Um, he has Hey oh. Shabby here. <laughs> oh. <laughs> but it's only, it's only once, though, isn't it? I literally... Yeah, yeah it's only, only once, once, to be fair. Day. Not every yeah, day. Jude was every day. Yeah. Every morning. Every morning it was <laughs> with Jude. I literally done a stream yesterday with... Go and check it out. With Flawless, Sarcasm City. And mm. I said, Amrim is mm. very much liked. He's Edward's man. So it's okay. not a foregone conclusion. Wow. It's going to be Amrim or Alonso. Okay. So that was the latest, latest information. As you guys know... In Ruben Amrim. Yeah. As <laughs> so you know, information yo, yo, yo. changes, things change as you go along. And I said Amrim is not gonna, by Michael Edwards. As soon as Edwards came, I'm not gonna came lie. back, Amrim became favourite. I'm not going to lie. I think we need to investigate Grizz Khan TV because the amount of fraudulent stories that come out of that You can. There is no such thing. You can go investigate it. That's been, no, no, no. We that's need, been we... closed down. Grizz Khan TV is closed down. <laughs> All right, cool. We need to investigate. We got done. We got done. We got, 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 got by. You go and investigate Grizz Khan TV. <laughs> we, need to, we, need, we need to investigate football carnage because you can't be spreading false news about Jabby Alonso to, to Liverpool when he's staying in that neighbourhood and you can't be doing that come on it's nasty work it's nasty work <laughs> man said man said GB news of YouTube you know <laughs> <laughs> hey listen that GB news is mad but now listen man it ain't easy man you know what I'm trying to say like I told you man after clock it's looking spooky man I mean Javi Alonso it's good for him though I'm glad he don't go to Liverpool and, 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 and ruin his career man just chill over there learn your trade and then come back when you're ready. I think it's too soon. This idea that you're fighting Javi Alonso for one I season. Think he, I think he's going to go to Madrid. Yeah. I think he's going to go to Madrid. I think. Wait, two years. In two yeah, years. Yeah, time. yeah, yeah, yeah. Ancelotti. Yeah. yeah. I think he's going to. I think he's. Look, he's a classy wow. guy, man. He's going to. He's going to want to give them one season in the Champions League. In the, you know, after guiding them there, so he can't. If he goes to Bayern, then that's a smack in the face for us. A hundred percent agree. That's what yo he dunked on Liverpool bad. If he no, goes Bayern Munich, yo, I can I can confirm no, wait, 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 by sorry, my sorry, sources. We... It's it's gonna be Madrid. It's gonna be Madrid. It will be. Uh, yeah, if he goes Madrid, is... then that kind of makes if, sense. If, if as, is... as Matisse said, it makes sense for him. For sure, hmm. he's played there as well. Let's remember, he played for all three clubs. So he's Spanish, yeah. man. He's played for Bayern. Yeah, he's, he's played for Spanish. He's played for Bayern as well. Yeah, yeah all three clubs. Yeah, all three, all three. Yeah, I think Klopp's going but Real, man. Nah, 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 it's not his kind Klopp's of club. Go it's not his kind team, of club. Man. Not his kind of club for me. Club's got national, go national team heritage. Mm. You, you know what? You know what? I, I you know what I find interesting. What I find interesting is that this, if if he does go to Real Madrid, this will be the third time Real Madrid have slapped Liverpool's head in the last three years. Do you remember? Two, oh, two on, eight years. They got slapped. They got their eight heads years. slapped. Got, Whose head don't they slap? They got their heads slapped. Living Real Madrid. Jude, Jude, Jude Bellingham, they got their head slapped. And, and do you remember the same summer they were doing Hey Jude? Even just this Jabby Alonso thing. I remember just like a week ago. Oh, Liverpool a week fans ago, I saw Liverpool fans yeah. doing, doing, oh, imagine this is how Jabby Alonso is going to set us up next season. We're going to have Jeremy Frimpong. And I said, hang on a second. Why are you so sure Jabby Alonso is going to be managing at Liverpool? Fact. Why? It didn't make sense to me. Now it makes sense because it Word. wasn't true. It was make-believe. Too much dip on the chip, as Toby would say. Mm. Oh, Ruben! Uh, there you go. Ruben Amrim is now the front runner for Liverpool job. There you go. Go on then. Hey Amrim, then go on. Might as well now. Hey Amrim, I'm telling you, it was, it, I said last. I said literally, it's one of them two. 
It's but do you have a plan? Do you have a plan B but if it's not fans, Ruben? No. Yeah, no, I was gonna say no. Well, what if Chelsea coming two, from? What if Chelsea coming fans, from? I was, I was, Chelsea. I've been told De Zerbi is not in the running now. If he suddenly becomes manager, that's pure when you know I got it wrong completely. I don't but like what you're doing, Saeed. You're trying to line us up for slander because you know right now we can't compete with Liverpool for managers. Don't do that, yeah. bro. Listen, don't I'm hearing that. Chelsea are in for him. That's all I'm no. saying. No. So, you know what I mean? Don't miss no, out I on think, that one. I think, you know I mean? think yeah, no, Chelsea are in for Amarim. 100% they are. Yeah, that's what I said. That's what I said. So, at least we can, you know hopefully I mean? we can pull, at least we can dunk Listen, on Chelsea. Listen, you're, you're not going to lose to us again after the Kaiseido Lamia thing. If Madrid can dunk on us, we can dunk on Chelsea. You know what I mean? We're going to leave here with something. <laughs> are you underwhelmed? Huh? Is. Are you underwhelmed? No, because he's a top guy. Uh, the sentimental Alonso appeal was there, but the the stats and the facts and the data as we're going to work towards all pointed to Ruben Amrim. Edwards, Michael Edwards, as soon as he was appointed, it was said that he's pure Ruben Amrim number one fan. Um, and so, so I did. And the love affair, the mm, love affair so... with Alonso, I get it, but the people that, the people that know the coaching industry all speak about Ruben Amrim as the next best young thing in, in, in coaching terms. So I've yeah, got, I've got a question. As a fan base, I want, I want, I think Turkish is more asking, not, not about what Michael Edwards thinks and not about. No, that, no he Edwards. asked me as under Because, I, I, because I'm I, think, I think the question is fair and I don't really believe the answer because the amount of hype that Liverpool fans were projecting about Jabby Alonso coming in, the next big manager, he's got that affiliation to Liverpool and then to, to I, find out like this abruptly that, it ain't happening. There definitely has to be a sense of underwhelming. No, 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 not for me. He asked me. Yeah, I but said, you start talking said, about what Michael Edwards wants, not what you want. No, wanted. no, no. I said it's not. No, I, I, if you listen carefully, I answered the question with no, I'm not underwhelmed. I'm deaf in one ear today, by the way. I've got cotton wool in here, so I actually couldn't hear properly. Well, there you go then. There you go. I actually said no, I'm not underwhelmed because I knew it's going to be one of the two. And so I'd done my studying on Amrim and he's the, so, he's the top, top, top young quality. I... But the sentimental, I agree with you. My choice would have been Alonso, but because of the love affair with Alonso, more than yeah. I know have any knowledge about how they coach in terms of that data and, and stats. And he's more experienced. Oh. He's, he's been in the job for a few years, whereas Alonso's second year. Yeah. So, 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 because uh, uh, I actually did research on Amarin when he was linked to us last season, right? And yeah. he, he's, he's very much an outlier in a good way. Um, in terms of what he's done in Portugal. But the problem, the, not a problem, but what I want to understand is, are your fans going to have like his style of play? Because I don't think his style of play is bad from what I've seen, but he sets up free at the back, wing backs. Sometimes I've seen that in, in, in game sporting can be quite pragmatic. They don't really, they don't, it's, it, it's not really, it's not really the same, it's not the same profile football that you would see under Jurgen Klopp, which is, aggressive high line, aggressive press, et cetera, et cetera. So it's going to be is, a, a, but a what do we say in, about, in, in, football, what do we say? in football style of play now. I agree with you. He does set up differently. But one thing I will say is Sporting Lisbon are one of the big dogs in, in, in Portugal. So they wouldn't be expected to play on the counter-attack every week. Do you get it? So them alongside Benfica and Porto would most weeks be favourite until unless they're playing each other. So you'd have to play a lot, a lot of front foot football. Um, which bodes well, yeah, but formation wise, formation wise, and tactic wise, we know all the great young coaches. If there's something about them, they adjust accordingly to the to the players, to the culture. So let's see how it goes. You know, we've seen no, other I coaches you. bring the same culture, but let's see if he adapts or if he thinks yeah. no, that's the way forward. It's more, it's more to some of your fans, right? So I think, I think you, you're keeping a good and open mind set to it, right? Which is, which I think you should be because I think. Everything we've seen about this guy points to someone who clearly can coach. But I'm just more on mm. about your fans. How long is it going to take before your fans start expecting something that great question? He either would he either will take a long time to to tweak or build style, or he might not do at all. Like he deviate from from a back three, right? Because that's what that's what served him well in Portugal, right? He might not he might not be the ultra aggressive rock and roll football like he may go to Liverpool and he may say I, I don't want to be the protagonist I still want to be the antagonist so what happens then? I think I think that is much more a, I think that's a top quality question because the patience factor 
and how much time you give a coach will come into play now. So the noise was if we appoint Zabi Alonso, the fans will give him much more time because it's Zabi Alonso. Whereas mm. now it's going to be Amrim on the back of Klopp. He, wow, he's walking into the cauldron. So I, you're right. I don't know. I think he needs to hit the ground running, so to speak. But as a fan base, normally we're more patient than other fan bases. I'm looking at you, Chelsea uh, and United. Uh, we're a bit more patient. We're a bit more patient with our we go, we go on coaches soon, and players. We but you're right. We go, it's exactly. a totally different yeah, we scenario. It's all right. This is a, now. Listen, later on. I agree. It's, it's, it's a totally different all, scenario but, to Alonso. That's what I agree. It's all good and well yeah, saying you're talk. patient. Oh, God. It's, now you're good. Sorry, it's, yeah, it's good. all good and well saying you're patient. I'm not sure. I'm not sure if you can hear me. Can you not hear me? Yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, so what I was saying is, it's all good and well saying you're patient. And I hear that. And I was very much of the same mindset with us this summer. But patience has its threshold, right? Because it's like... He's finished. Yeah, we ain't got patience for you. Yeah, yeah, yeah finished. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> we, yeah, yeah, we ain't got that much patience for you. Get out. <laughs> <laughs> we don't, we don't you're, done out, you're done out here. Get out. Finished. Yeah, deduction three lying, points. Man. Deduction I'm on full three screen, that man. Look at the finalize <laughs> now. Finalize. <laughs> finalize that deduction. But points point deduction confirmed. People, people are saying great point. You know when people are saying great point. Not enough Great point, Toby. Yeah. Great point. You've broken financial fair play rules, brother. Dash him, Turkish. Dash yep. him. FFP, you've broken the laws. We should dash him, and he was moving like a bull in a China yeah, shop. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Ticket inspector's asking to see your ticket, man. Get out. <laughs> yeah, man, even pays ticket, man. It's crazy. <laughs> Don't do that, man. Man's dressed like, you know what I mean? Yeah. Like, the he's, he's doing up. Remember when you was looking at the the first few shows, Grizz? He's doing up that level of quality. We've we've all leveled up. Bro, come yeah. on, man. Twenty twenty four. Yeah, twenty twenty four. This is twenty twenty four, big six, not twenty twenty big six, man. <laughs> Lord. Get with oh, the Lord. times, Toby. <laughs> <laughs> He's doomed. His connection is still frozen in this. Actually, he's just gone. He's just gone. He's right, doing. Cool. He's doing. He's doing Big Steve Stockport internet. Do you remember in the first couple of shows? Yeah. <laughs> wow. He's doing the Stockport Wi-Fi. And, and oh, wow, man. When Steve would put the laptop like this. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> oh, that was hilarious, man. <laughs> <laughs> doing a face reveal. But Big Steve face mad. reveal. Trust me. Oh, Lord. It's mad. Oh, those were the days, man. Those were the days, man. Coming on, on that topic. Um, where are we? Where are we? Actually, Tobes has just returned as well. Do I even bother? Do I even bother? Yes, I'm, not gonna game, lie. I'm not going to lie. He was actually making some great He was. That's, that's, the, that's, 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 that's what's such a that's shame. That's the best bit, yeah. <laughs> Let's try again. Master, what happened? I'm back. I'm back. But yeah, no. I, All right. Sorry. The point I was making is I think... I quite like the look of Amarin. I just don't know. I don't know if it's going to be um, if it's going to be too big, too big, like a, a step for him at this point of his career, relative to the job that he's walking into. Because I think he's a talent manager, but I'm not going to lie. I think it's always it's always difficult to step into the shoes of like generational managers, right? It's always going to be the case. Like you see, you saw it at Man United. It didn't work, right? Um, I'm trying to think of another example. Man City, we're going to see it soon with Pep. We're going to see it soon with Pep. They want to talk about, oh, we got the structures, we got this and that and the third. It's always easy. It's always easy to jump. Yeah, see, so his Wi Fi doesn't even believe his Wi Fi. So he do have it in place. We'll be just fine. That's another charge, I'm afraid, because yeah. you're definitely doing something uh, to be cutting this. Uh, we'll see. We'll see. <laughs> I, heard, I heard what you said. We'll see. We'll see. We'll see. We'll see. <laughs> <laughs> I told you, don't force it though, man. Don't force it. Go and do what you're doing, man. No, I'm enjoying it. I'm enjoying it. I like this. Yeah. You like it? Yeah. <laughs> right, cool. Hopefully, the viewers do as well. Because if they don't, then let me know, people. Um, <laughs> right, let, let me look at what the people are saying. Um, actually, there's a few. You know what? I'm gonna get the ones in on Klopp and then get the ones in on the, the um, content and the draft video because there's a few on on different on different things. Um, Lemur says Grizz has multiple credible sources 
Sadly, they all complement wings better than they complement breaking news. <laughs> <laughs> Bars. Bars. That's cold. That's cold. It's not all that. It's not all that. You're forcing it. You're forcing it. You're like forcing it. Look at your laughs. Nah, Huey would have laughed the most if it was funny. That's quality. Huey would have laughed the, that's quality. Quality. Laughed the loudest if it was funny. Trust me. You're, you're going into a low block like your potential Huey, new Huey manager. You need to relax, bro. That's yeah. Huey didn't laugh. Yeah, it's long. I don't think it's funny. He didn't laugh. <laughs> he didn't it's, laugh. It's, it's don't use me unanimous. as your metric it's got, whether it's funny or not, man. It's got to be unanimous. <laughs> Did you not hear? He just told you he can't hear anything. Huey just said he's deaf. Bro, I'm deaf and one ear tonight, man. It was probably hilarious. <laughs> why? <laughs> Sorry. Is no one gonna ask? Huge. That Irish. Huge. 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 That Irish. That the cotton bud affects his earring. <laughs> hey, Hugh. Hugh, can you hear me? Is no. Is nobody Huge. gonna ask why he's deaf? He man, he's got Grizz cold water and he can't read. Grizz's sources compliment wings more than they compliment breaking news. Ah! Wings. Ah, that's a very good one. That's a very good one. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> Sorry, Chris. <laughs> <laughs> Sorry, Chris. Um, Box of Oranges says if Javi Alonso wants to go to Madrid, he needs to leave this summer. If Leverkusen finish third or fourth mm. next season, he won't be as attractive to them anymore. The risks nah, he take. Won't. He just needs to cl close that league. He'll be fine. He'll he'll be there. Yeah. Watch and um, game message watching from Thailand is 4 a.m. here. Big up anyway, big up you lot and Grizz. Let's win this effing title, Liverpool fan. Big up, bro. <laughs> big, big support. 4 a.m. Big love. Yeah, man. Big up. Shamar says Grizzly Bear should be lost points on the table. Jude now Jabby 95%. Shake my head. We are tired. Bro, who done that tweet, man? One of these fuckers done that tweet, man. It wasn't me, you <laughs> idiots, man. Do you think I would tweet something like that? Who was it, Toby? Was it you? I don't know. It's from the main account. I don't know. It's took my says. Okay, let me analyze. Was <laughs> it Was it Said? No, no, definitely not me. Definitely not me. <laughs> right, you know, we we just we could just blame it on score and move on. It's okay. Yeah. Uh, yeah. I'm gonna research. I think that's it. I think that's it on on Klopp. But there is a few. Um, on the draft video, Fuego says, Turkish, you guys should either simulate or play as the actual teams you guys chose on Oy. the draft. <laughs> I said it, you. Can you do that? Yeah, yeah. Well, all I them players... Are all I said you guys in the house after we recorded. Oy. Maybe we do that, man. Cool. Maybe we do that. Let's do it. Can I re okay. Your Honour, because I can't play the fucking damn game. Can I, no, no, you can rang I... about 20 men to tell us how good you are at FIFA and pairs and all these games. <laughs> <Isn't it>? <laughs> <laughs> Put me in power really in six and I teach you. Oh, tell them how good I am at FIFA, man. Bro, I'm in bed, man. Leave me alone. <laughs> <laughs> all, right, we, all right, we play on Pro 6 then. We play on Pro 6 and I'll whip your ass. Come on then. Pro we play six. on Pro 6. Mm. Pro, pro, pro 6, six you know. Pro 6 Come is on. That's, yeah, that's, go, that's, that's go. heritage. What year that's was heritage. Pro 6? People in the chat, let me know what, what year Pro 6 was out, man. That was like, that was what, 2006, like 2005? Was it? No, it's yeah. 2005. It would, 2005 it season. Out. Yeah. Pro 6. It, it would always come out a year a year ahead. Yeah. Um, yeah so we, like next one we have from Moski, or Moski saying, yo, I was the guy who debated Matisse and won. Thanks for the experience. Right, big up. With you all and looking forward to any future link ups. Love for the love as always. Can I Listen. can I interject and defend my brother? Why is he spoiling? Why is he spoiling? Because Matisse would never defend me, but I'm a community man. He said he won man. as well. Yeah, exactly. I'm a community man. Now nah, he won. Big man. up Mosky. Big up Mosky. You were done wicked. You done brilliant. You did not beat Matisse. Matisse was goated. We don't want to give too much away. That's all we're gonna say mm. until the footage comes out. But big up Mosky. Big up. But you did not beat my brother. My brother was goated. Mm. Goated. I'm going to give it to Moskin, man. He came with some good points, oh, man. You're a he came with some solid points. I'm such a hater. Bro, man. listen, man. I'm just saying it from the outsider. I was a fan, man. You ain't no I was outsider, a fan. Man. I was watching it. <laughs> I was an outsider. I was just watching it. And I was listening to the debate, man. Moskin. Yo, man. He killed it. That's what we're going to say. All we should say is those vids, they're fire. Just wait. That's what, I'm say. what what an incredible idea from Skull, man. That that shit Top. was amazing. Yeah, yeah. Now nah, big up Skull, man. Shit, man. That's gonna break. That's gonna break the internet. I can't wait to go to Manny. Real. For all you lovers yeah. out there of, of Toby, Manny, yo, I'm, I'm going, now I'm becoming for Manny, though. I'm building my army. Toby argument. 
So what we're gonna do? So what we're gonna do? Manny, what's the what's the city after Manny that we're gonna do? Oh, one, like, we said Dublin. Time. Dublin, did we we're say? I'm pushing for Dublin. Yeah, in the polls, I'm pushing. I'm pushing. Let's, Dublin. Do, <laughs> let's do Manny in Dublin. Yeah, Manny in Dublin. I want to, yeah, I want to see the Irish man turn up. And also yeah. Turkish is Irish. Irish. It's about time you, you 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 know what I mean about time. Yeah, we, yeah, no. We got you back back in in Dublin as well, man. It's not yeah, just yeah, you. Yeah, yeah, He's gonna wear. Honestly, he's gonna wear the Irish. Yeah, my, 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 my one's gonna be in London, though. My one. Yeah, has yeah, to be yeah. yeah, yeah, yeah. Because yeah, of Arsenal fans. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You can do. Yeah, you might be able to do Grizz. Grizz. Yeah, in, yeah in Grizz. Dublin, yeah, because bro. Liverpool. There's bare Liverpool fans in Ireland. Bare. Yeah, I need United. Are you lot mad? I'm too many. Dublin. All right, let's do this. Oh, yeah. yeah, man, let's do it. Let's do it. I think, I think, I think it. Manny's 30, and then we let the chat decide the next city after Manny. Manny's 30. Yeah, yeah. yeah these, man will, this, these man will pick LA. And, you know, <laughs> with, uh, it has to be, long has day. To be UK based. It has to be UK based, but we can't be doing <laughs> it. Has to be UK we can't be getting based, votes yeah. for like, we can't be getting oh, votes for like black. Show, it needs to be. Yeah. We can't be doing but double the UK, so let's just like black. Yeah, wait, wait, like one that. brother's got one brother's got a point. Man. Say. 45 minutes, he goes, Talk about the biggest game of the season, man. Let's do this, man. Yeah, it's yeah. not that it's big, is it really, guys? It's Come huge, on. it's actually huge. It's monumental. Are you mad? Don't be huge. Come man. on, it's a formality. <laughs> Manchester City are gonna win. Come on, yeah, yeah, yeah. Wow. this. Okay. Okay. Bro, I'm, I'm, it's huge. Yeah, it's huge. It's huge. I'm so excited about this, but yeah, man. Circus, would you say that this is. Would you say that this huh? is the biggest Ars- this I would say this is the biggest Arsenal game since since probably your FA Cup final. final. FA, FA Cup final um under Arteta, the most important game for Arsenal, easily. Oh, that's easy. Yeah, yeah. Oh, that's okay, all right, let yeah. me go one step back. Let me go one step back. The most important game since give me like a pivotal Cham- like, Champions League final game against Barcelona. Had. Yeah, go there. That's two thousand and five now. The, um... That's the, 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 the yeah the last yeah the sorry, last two thousand six the, f- the last yeah. title when you run yeah the Leicester game was big but the thing about the yeah but it was Leicester Man City's no nah, Baku Chelsea this four one that's that one's this big one's yeah you got big definitely that, that, final, that final that final was a big one that final that Europa League final was a big yeah one. Man said we're talking, okay, yeah, since then. We're since talking then. league sense or, or major trophy <laughs> sense now. so it probably is Champions League final. No, nah, man, I want to take this. This is it, man. This is, this is, I don't know. You, why am I telling you what it is? What do you mean, this is it? Nah, they like, must, they, they got to go there and win. They got to go there and win, sorry. I think nah, they, don't they, they don't have to win, man. They, they don't have to win. Oh. 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 No, no, no. Oh. What are we doing? They got to win. Oh, they got to go they don't have win. to win, man. You know what? The title's not The title's not one of They got to go there and win. On Sunday. What are you talking about must win? It's not a must win. Yeah, no, I'm, it is I'm a, with I'm with Saeed today. It's must not lose. That's yeah, what it yeah, is. Yeah, yeah, yeah. No, no, no. Okay. Yeah. Okay. On paper, on, on paper, it's a must not lose. But in terms of the psychological blow, it's a must win. If you go, mm. the internet doesn't even agree with you, man. Shush. <laughs> <laughs> can we can we full screen? Yeah, let's full screen that so we can get a photo out of it, man. Yeah, let's leave with something because this is ridiculous. Yeah, we'll leave with something. <laughs> yeah, he's gonna think he's on his man. own in the back studio. Yeah, we've been very patient, man. <laughs> he's getting off as well, man. Is he getting off? Yeah, of course he's getting off. This guy's he's actually on the Moss Boss right now. That's why he's saying people <laughs> the, Moss <laughs> the Moss Boss. <laughs> Look at Look, this there's, guy, no, there's the other guy with him. Yeah, bro, it's all mad. Oh, is that his best friend? Remember the guy that was on the show last time? <laughs> nah, that, name? that guy. He's that's awesome, that... Yeah, nah, call that's... that man. Is it that guy? What's his name again? <laughs> nah, it won't be surely. Uh, what was his name? Big um, tricks, was it? Big, big tricks, tricks, man. Big, big tricks. tricks. Yeah. Big tricks, yeah. Big tricks. Big yeah, the big, big tricks and Tobes on the Moss bus. <laughs> I <laughs> madness going on there. <laughs> this is crazy. Um, oh dear. No, but what would you say? No, no, I don't. I don't agree with it. I don't yeah, agree with saying. what Toby's saying there. Like psychologically, if they lost the game, I think that's going to be damaging. But if they come out with a draw and they and they avoid defeat, I think that's 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 more than better. Because at the end of the day, you haven't lost. You haven't felt that loss against Man City. You get what I'm trying to say? Whereas last year they felt it, and even though they were on the decline anyway, 
it kind of just like further solidified their decline and they just almost like, you know, they, they fell apart really. Let's be honest. I think they lost to Southampton after that or they drew Southampton. So, yeah, man, I just think for me, go away without a loss and I think psychologically you feel a bit better. Draw at, at the Etihad, it's not a bad result, man. And their record as well this season at the Etihad is not great in terms of obviously beating. Only United they've beaten, I think it is. Everyone else, draw. So, and I think they've got a few injuries as well. So, if they win, perfect. Unbelievable result. Psychologically crazy. But the main thing is you don't come out there with a loss. Even if it's a 2-1, even if it's one of them like last-minute winners, no. Because psychologically, they want to go there and think, you know what? We've kept it for another week. And then we go from there. So, yeah, that's 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 the way I kind of look at it for me. Yeah, I mean, that, a loss will be a damning blow because a loss will put us, you know, essentially needing to be flawless for the last what nine games after that and and you know it's it's well documented that our running is probably the most i say probably is the most difficult when you take into kind of away games still left and the level of opposition the mm. rivalries involved in there as well so a loss will be it's this game is not make or break either way but a loss puts yeah. it close to break for us but a win but such as favourite, that's how tight this title race is, in my opinion. Because even oh, if it was to and be labelled favourites, Liverpool should be on the same points as us. Because I, I assume they'll beat Brighton. But bruv, it does feel like it does feel like it's not a. I agree with Tobes on a we must. It's more with Saeed, I think that we must not lose the game. But there is a feeling where Grizz mentioned earlier that it feels like the time is now to get it done. You get it, and if someone offered me a point now and said, you know, Monday Monday morning you wake up, it's a point. I wouldn't take it. I'll take it in the after the game. If we if we get a point, I think after ninety plus minutes, I'll take that. I won't take it now because I actually think we have a chance to win the game. Spe- and I strike while the iron is hot. That's what you got to do. You got to strike while the iron is hot, bro. I'm hearing there's no John Stones. I'm hearing there's no Carl Walker, and this is a team that pipped you to the title last year. You have to strike while the iron is hot, man. You have to. And what you got to take into consideration is those fixtures that you said that you got coming up, the hardest fixtures. If you beat Man City now, you give yourself a little wiggle room. You give yourself some margin for error later down the stage. You have to win. Sorry. You have to. If I was an Arsenal fan, if I was an Arsenal fan, I'm going in there saying, nah, we must, we must, we must, we must. I, dis- I disagree. To. You have to. Bro. I dis- Sorry. You have I disagree. To Go get you're, go- you're, you're going up go against. Go get three points. You're going up against the best team in the Man world. City. In it, man. Yeah, you're going Man's up against team, the best team in the world. The best, the best manager points. in the world. Look at him, look at him. He's trolling, man. I do it. I do it. I'm not even trolling. I'm not even trolling. I'm being... The best DM actually, in the best striker in the world. The best DM in the world. Right? The three times in a row winners. The treble winners, right? you got to have some You got to have some respect when you go to these places. I'm sorry. You ju- you just do. And Arsenal have shown this season that they can hang with these two teams, Liverpool and City, over the course, right? Even though they haven't taken that... I thought they needed to go and make a big lead and go on a rampant run like they did last year and go and make a gap for themselves. They've just hang in there the whole way with this style that they've been kind of to and fro with. Sometimes they go blitz, sometimes they go they go control. So I personally think it's more than acceptable for them to lose this game and carry on as they're going. Do you know what I mean? Like that's that's how I'd see it. If I was an Arsenal fan, you, you lose yeah, this but... game, you just you just pick up and go again. Shouldn't be turning on the that's team. Not the point. Shouldn't, be a, shouldn't be a crisis or anything. You know, Tobes trying to put all this I'm pressure on you guys. Believe me, I'm there's no pressure coming pressure. from me. No pressure on my side. You, to, you guys, you guys go out there. You guys go out there and you give it your best. Yeah, you give it your best, listen, and listen. that's all that matters at the end. It's only for you, you, Matisse, you're going, you're going too easy on Arsenal here, man. That's 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 not. Ah, right. he's, he's, he's fucking he's, trolling, man. He's he's like being a pussy. He's being a pussy. You know, can't you don't know Matisse well enough, now. Little fucking rat, bro. Little rat, bro. Go and interview someone, you prick. Now that you got to interview someone new, you can bring someone <laughs> around, man. Why don't you go around? He's got a new fucking interview thing coming out, homegrown or some shit. Homegrown. Oh, <laughs> <laughs> you see, that's how you get him. That's how you really get him. Know what you lot are doing? You man just go up and knock on the door. You got, you got to look around the side window. You know what I'm saying? This look is, in the you know what? Yeah, you got to do it. You know what, Matisse? Like fair that. enough. Sorry, sorry. <laughs> Fair enough. Fair enough. We did outside the USA embassy. I didn't. I didn't. I didn't understand your game, but now I understand it. Thank yeah, you. tactics. I, I get it now. I was. I wasn't sure at the beginning. <laughs> I wasn't yeah. sure. <laughs> I wasn't. I wasn't familiar with your game. I'm now familiar, yeah, and I love it. You like it. I love it. We yeah. must. 
Yeah, we must. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> um, There's no shame oh. in losing. It's about taking part. That's what counts. <laughs> 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 what, what you're saying tongue in cheek i mean i love it i love it uh, like i said a loss a loss is damning a draw i'll I'll take it but we need to go for it we need to go for it i think stones Are is you... a big loss there's no one there's no one in their defense that can re replicate what stones does for i mean them. i mean stones but... misses like 80 percent of the season anyway so yeah that's a no, That's a different relentless. conversation. He's relentless. Different conversation for a different day. <laughs> He's relentless. <laughs> Get on your plane and fuck off with it. <laughs> <laughs> oh my goodness. Um, <laughs> no days off. No days off. I think Walker will play, though. I think Walker will play. Sounding like he's. he's uh, I don't think so. I think it's going to be a back four of Akanji, Diaz, Ake, and Vardiel. Yeah. Do you see? Do you think with that back four, you 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 go in? It's hard not to think you would, but do you think with the injuries you have, you go in to to you know take the game to us? Yeah, I, I would expect us to, regardless of, of injuries. It's in our place. You haven't won at our place since pre Pep Guardiola era. So, like in in, in some ways, Eddie had is like for you what Anfield is for us. It's become one of those places where. We just do what we need to do. I'd expect you to be front-footed. We're at the stage now where we've not fluked our way, but we've found ourselves in a position through one reason or another where with a terrible big six record, we're still in the mix for the Premier League. It's now time where we simply have to turn it up. I believe it's must-win for us. I think it's must-win for us because it if is. we lose this game, if we lose this game, we're putting ourselves four points behind. You know, Liverpool will be will have the bit between their teeth at that stage. There's a certain sense of inevitability about them. They'll take massive motivation. But for Arsenal, I think Toby's point is it's accurate. The psychological boost Arsenal will take, and especially from all the hype, I think Arsenal, for just a, I don't know, like a standpoint point of view, they need to win this game. I mean, when we were at the Big Six meetup in London a couple of weeks ago, so many Arsenal men coming up saying, yeah, we're going. this is the year we beat you. We're better than you in this position. We're better than you in that position. This is the year we've got something for you. If you're going to send for the king, you best not miss. Come and do it then. All this talk, you better come up to the Eddie Hat and do it. That's what I'm saying. Facts. Big facts, mm. and I don't. I don't want Arsenal fans to see that as a, oh, you're doing too much pressure. Like, Arsenal winning or losing this game won't change the fact that they're a top side, they're a top football side at the moment. But there's been a lot of narrative, not by me, even though they are really good. There's been a lot of narrative by Arsenal fans in recent weeks and pundits said they're playing the best football in the country. They're the best team at this point in time. They've obviously scored the most goals, conceded the least, so they've got all the underlying metrics and undersurface metrics to suggest outside of the league position. In fact, no, league position, league, league position, I think they're first, right? They're first or second, I can't even yeah, remember. Yeah. So you got everything pulling in your direction to suggest that you are the best team in the league at this point in time. And if you want to be the champions, these are the type of games you really need to go and win. Because Man City, when pressure was hot last season, they came to your ground and what did they do? They won. And Steve came out and did that video talking about the Sharks can smell blood in the water, blah, blah, blah. And the rest is history. So now you have an opportunity to do the same thing to Man City. Sorry, like not even trying to do it as a Spurs fan over egging it. As a neutral, you've got to be going there looking to win this game of football. Sorry, there's no way you could be playing the football you've played in 2024 with the players that you have fit and available and you're going there and you're saying, nah, oh, I'll take a draw. Yeah, a draw is not going to kill your title challenge, but a win does so much for you. Sorry, go there and get a result. Simple. Go there and win. I think it'll also. I think it'll also um, massively earn the respect of the rest of the world football of Arsenal. <laughs> too. I think the rest of the world football will go. All right, they are serious. They've gone to the Eddie Head. They've got that monkey off their back. They've done what they need to do because there's so much talk from Arsenal fans. I don't mean you Turkish, but I mean Arsenal fans in general. A big fan base. They're very loud. So much talk about what they're gonna do, and then if they don't win, it's always oh well, you know, we didn't have the players or city's budget and this kind of thing. No, now you must. Now you must. Last season, it was your first season in the title race in a long time. Two, four, seven days on top, you let it slip. You had that experience, you've added Deck and Rice, you've beaten us twice this season. Come up to the Eddie Hadn't do it when it matters the most. No one really cares if you do it in October or August. Come up when it matters the most. I believe we're going to win. I'm putting my chest out. I fully back City. I've watched City in too many title races, too many clutch moments, do what they need to do for me to not back City. No Stones, no Walker, no Kanji, no whoever. I still hey, back City. favourites for the game. That's why... Like, yeah. mm. 
Like the 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 animosity that that Tobes is talking with is well off mark. If I'm honest with you, this is definitely our best chance. But to say we need to go to the Etihad and win, what animosity? Nah. That's what what saying, animosity? There's, there's, overdoing there's no, it. You're overdoing it. You're overdoing it. You're overdoing it. There's no animosity. There's no animosity. There's literally no animosity. But people, people, it's the way you're talking about it. It's like it's what a, way? It's a good, what way am I talking? It's a God given right that this is now our time to beat them. Like this is this is Manchester City. We are the most informed team right now. Yes. Okay. This is yeah, they, mm. Man City are the best team in the world. We are the most informed Listen. team. Yes. My Man City are the best team in the world, and they're at Bro, home. And they, I'm they saying. backs against the wall. We can talk about Arsenal, and you've done that. That's why I'm going to talk about City because we're disregarding City. And uh, no, not. and the importance for them in this sense as well, because you dismissed it by saying, "Oh, last year City had done what they needed to do against you." Yeah, but that's not to say that they're not going in with that same mentality again. They're going to have to do. Think, Hugh just said it. If they lose the game, they're four points behind. So we'll yeah, we'll face I, a City team that also has to win. Probably has to win more than we have to win this one. They both. The draw, the draws no I, I agree. The draws no I use agree. for me. I think I think a draw suits you much better because it simply gets the fixture out of the way. It simply just gets the fixture out of the way, and you can move on and focus on I the remit. You've got you've got yeah, the out of the way. Yeah, I, I, Turkish, I agree. I agree. I think so. I don't want this to be misconstrued as oh, I'm only saying it for the Arsenal side. It's a must win for Man City. It's a six pointer for both teams. I'm just giving the perspective of why it shouldn't just be a oh yeah, a draws. A draw is not. It's not a bad result, but it shouldn't just be a oh yeah, I'm, I'm fine with a draw. No, it should be. We need three points, and it, the same goes for Man City as well, especially at home. Especially at home for Man City. I'm trying to think of their record at home. They didn't beat yeah, Liverpool. Okay. They, did, they didn't let's beat say, us. Let, Tobes, let's say we draw. Let, 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 let's win. just let's say we draw. Are you telling me I shouldn't be fine on Monday? No, I'm not saying you shouldn't be fine on Monday. That's not what I'm but saying. But I'm saying, saying, but you're saying fans shouldn't act like a draw is fine. But yeah, you, but no, I was gonna say. I, I, okay, okay. You, you should be fine. I shouldn't be fine. If we draw. You should be fine in terms of your title charge. You shouldn't be fine about that result. I think on Monday, if you come back with a draw, you should be disappointed. Sorry, and I'm not. That's not even being disrespectful to Man City. That's basically you not being able to capitalize on your opportunity to beat the best team in the land at their patch. That's what I'm trying to say. That's what I'm trying to say. I hope that's yeah. clear. That's a, like even in, I mean, even in fierce title battles or rivalries, winning at the opposition ground is 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 a massive thing, you know. And it, and it, and it and it's not something that happens every season. Let alone a rivalry that's just in its baby stages. You know, this is the second season now we are competing with Man City at the top of the league. So, of course, mm. I'm, I'm listen, I want to win the game. I wouldn't take a draw now. I'll reiterate that, but I will be fine come Monday if it is a draw because, like Hugh said. It keeps the ball rolling into the last nine games. The last nine games, we ain't got Liverpool or City, but we have got the hardest. It, you know, it would very much still be not in our hands because Liverpool should take advantage if we were to draw the game. They should be two points up on us. You know, hopefully not. Hopefully Brighton do something. But then it's all to, it's still all very much to play for. No one's really taken that psychological hit. Obviously, if mm. we lose, I think we, I think we do. It's not over, but if we lose, I do think we fall off and make it incredibly difficult for us. Mm. City or Liverpool is this is it, man. Not it's, 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 it, it, if you do go there and win, though, it's the biggest statement. It's the biggest statement you can make, man. I remember when um, Drogba made a perfectly timed run at Old Trafford to win us the the title over there, um, and it was just. I just remember just what thinking, was it? that was the day. That was the day where it was done, done and dusted. Um, you know, yeah, because it stuff. was offside. That's why. <laughs> I, th I think it's the prize that's at stake for Arsenal to win the game. I mean, we haven't lost in the Etihad in any competition since December 2022. Do you know what I'm saying? Do you know how mad that is? December 2022. We're now in what? Almost April 2024. If you come up and overturn us like that in our place in a title run-in, that's a massive. I, that's why I said to world football. I don't mean just to City. I don't mean just to Liverpool. I mean to the world football. We'll go wow. This Arsenal team really are about the hype that they've been talking about. If you come up and do it, and I, I, I suppose it. does have a bit of a point. Was it strike while the iron's hot? While you're playing really, really well, the next no, I get no, no, I get, I get Toby's point. I just don't agree with it. Like he can make a case for it about striking while the iron's hot with your injury situations, because I believe Walker and Stone's going to miss out. Akanji's fine. Edison's back, isn't he? But I don't know. We've, Arsenal, we've got no update on Edison. He trained today, apparently. Edison. Oh, is it? Yeah. So Edison will be Yeah, back. he trained, he trained. I've yeah, seen it. Edison will be back. Cuts. But Walker and Stones is huge. 
But on the flip side, Arsenal apparently Nelly's. Uh, I started calling him Nelly as well, like your fan base. Nelly's uh, struggling. You're just one of them. That's why, isn't yeah. it? I'm yeah. one. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Shit. <laughs> Got nicknames for them. De- got him. Decky. Decky okay, but, Nelly. But I, okay. I think. I think. The boost. It goes without saying, man. It's the most obvious thing to say. But if Arsenal rock up there and win. You know, you know. We, at the moment, we're looking at. Do you know what? Look at Arsenal's fixture list. It's looking peak. Oh my god! I'll start tough, panicking man, then. Yeah. Mm. If they go and win at City, mm. the that invincibility comes through mentality-wise as well. Thinking, yo, we just rocked up to Liverpool yeah. where we haven't won and we played them, mm. yeah. and then we've won at City. We've taken four points off Liverpool. We've taken six points if 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 you beat Man City. What's what's the rest of the Brighton away, Wolves away? Get out of here. It's an emergency think, meeting. There I, I say it's... Bayern Munich. There I say Bayern Munich and them, man. But I think their focus will be... Yeah, but Bayern Munich are not in the Premier League. This side. is my problem. I'll be no, I'm just yeah, saying that's in like, the momentum. I'm talking about nah. the momentum. Do you know what I'm trying but to say? At, at, you know what it is here? Now. We're at the stage of the season now where it's totally psychological. You, you've got to this point mm. in the season because we know you're good enough to be in and around the top of the league. But you get to the last nine, ten games, it's totally, totally psychological. And I always find with this March international break that the first game after tends to set the tone for how you're going to move into your running. Like last season, uh, international break after this one, we went on, we beat Liverpool 4-1. And all of a sudden, we started blitzing teams, playing unbelievable football. I would fear if we were to lose to Arsenal on Sunday, we got Villa three days later, um, and who are mm. in a big top four clash. I would fear that it might knock us, deject us. Uh, and for Arsenal, they'll take a massive boost from that. You, Arsenal will feel invincible, excuse the pun, if they can go and beat City in the Eddie Head this Sunday. So... There's a massive, like, it's six pointer and a psychological boost of the highest order for whatever team comes out on top. I think it's a psychological boost if Arsenal get a draw. They'll, they'll actually think they've gone it invincible is. if you if they it win is. there. Genuinely, we, that's not. A if point. it ends in a draw and we look like if it ends in a draw and we've got two days between the result and Luton, and we're looking back at the season and we're saying nine games to go against Liverpool and City, we took four points out of six against both. There won't, there won't be that feeling of invincibility, but there should be a feeling of, fucking hell, we got the two hardest jobs out of the way in in, in great fashion because give me four out of six points against City and Liverpool at the start of the season. I'll take that. That's something I would take at the start. Mm. So to I, be fair, think, though, Turkish, I, I was going to say, though, my last point on this, I think one point w- which supports your argument and probably weakens mine is I feel like you could probably make a case for Man City for quite a few games that you have towards the end of the season, right? Like, you can look at the game against us, go to there, beat us, and solidify your position wherever it is at the table. I think Arsenal are going to have a couple of these games, these really, really, like... In fact, every game is a crunch game, but you get what I mean. Like, you can make that scenario for a lot of these games, but I don't know, man. I just feel like... let me tell you something, Toby, yeah? Toby, I don't think there's a free hit in any game, man. I can't lie to you. You know what it is with me? The last 10 games, every game will just feel like... It's taking like forever. It's more than 90 minutes. It's, it feels like it's never ending. So I feel mm, like every yeah. game equally will yeah. have its importance. Because last season it was Southampton. They Southampton, dropped points. Yeah. It was games West where, Ham. you know what I mean? So I, I think for me, there's no free hits, man. It's literally game, every game you try and win it. And you know what I mean? You, you aim to do your best. Because bro, remember, them, them teams at the bottom are fighting for their lives now. Last 10 yeah, games. They're fighting they're for their lives, man. They need to sit in the Premier League. League. This is what Arsenal learned the man. hard way last if you, if you remember it, it, Arsenal last season, they were look they were pinpointing certain fixtures, saying mm, if we win these it? certain fixtures, we'll win the league. And then it was the yep. games they didn't look at were the ones where they dropped points. Yeah, psychological yep. battle, man. Every single one. That's mm, why I like yeah. how you come into this game because um, that was important last season. Antonio mentioned it on a podcast where he said, you know, the players are thinking about the Man City game with still games to play in between. And both games against Man City last season, we went into it. Having dropped points, the February one, Brentford one one, lost one nil to Villa. The the April or May one, I forgot exact date. We all know what happened against Liverpool, West Ham, Southampton leading up to it. This season, though, we knew at the beginning of we knew off the back of the international and um, not international break, the winter break, because we had just lost to Fulham and drawn and lost to West Ham as well. Actually, back to back, yeah, we knew that we had to hit the ground running. We can't afford any more slip ups. And we've got to get to that Liverpool game, you know, all things intact and, and and win it. We did that. After that Liverpool game, it was the same thing. We look at the fixtures and we say, 
31st of March is City. We need to win every game leading up to 31st of March now. Mm. Easier said than done, but we've done it. We even Brentford 1 1, where men, you know, mentally, psychologically, the players might think, shit, we're fucking it here. No, we got the job done 2 1, pulled out of the bag. So Porto, same thing, because after Brentford going out in Champions League against Porto could have just been a, a head fuck like Sporting was last year. We got the job done. This is why I am excited about Sunday. I'm not nervous at all. I'm excited because this is what I want Arsenal to be in. These big this is games. what I'm saying. And I hate I hate it, but like as a neutral, you you want your club to be fighting for something at this stage of the season. Sorry, concept. Sorry. This guy's yeah, bumping the train. Ticket, ticket. For his ticket. How many trains is <laughs> he getting? Yeah, exactly. How many trains is he getting? It's kind of funny, though. Know? Moving, I'm checking man. him. I'm um, checking in my bag, bro. I'm checking in my it's, bag. It's like a vlog. This one. This. This one. <laughs> yeah, I know, bro. This is this is like yo, like on tour with Toby, man. What? What? You know what I mean? Like <laughs> personally, I think I think it needs a little bit of editing. You know, it's a little bit long. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Camera, the camera, man. The camera, yeah. well. camera angle is not great. Um, it's yeah, not as good as funny. the big six draft video. Just a little where, shout where out to that it, video. <laughs> I forgot. It's a good idea, isn't it? What's, What's that? What's that? Um, What's that? I'm in Denver. I'm in Denver. 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 Big up Denver, man. Anyone from yeah. Denver in the chat? Big up to you, lot. <laughs> yeah. I'm annoyed. I didn't go to any um any cannabis dispensers, man. So I just... what's that? I don't yeah. know what that is. Yeah, no. Sorry. Oh, I, sorry. I see. Yeah. I see. I see. Pollen. I see. Pollen. Bro, yeah, bro, we don't bro. do that. <laughs> I see. Pollen. I see. Pollen. Yeah. yeah, we don't Me do that. Man, don't get involved in this. Kind yeah, of we don't do that. Bro, it's a family show. Family show sponsored by Opta. Thank you. Yep. Oh, community man in Ramadan. <laughs> I mean, I didn't, I didn't, I didn't say anything. Oh, that's, that's, me, that's man. Well, I, Listen, man, I this guy, man, you gotta give it to him. I didn't say anything that's controversial. It's legal here. I don't, I don't know what you want to say. It's legal here. Like, what? It's not legal here. It's not legal here, bro. Yeah, yeah, yeah. But I'm, bro, I'm, I'm, I'm not there. I'm here. <laughs> it's the show, man. Yeah, don't, don't, maybe, maybe you don't. This is the legitimate definition of don't go anywhere. Do you know what I'm yeah. saying? Yeah. <laughs> Pardon? This one, man. I am um, dying, man. I'm dying. I'm lying. This is funny. I'm lying. <laughs> Let me see what super chats we got in. Uh, oh. I've got the Who's mobile. That? Who's that? <laughs> show us, show us. Manisha. <laughs> Welcome uh, to the show. No, Your opinions on Man City Arsenal, please. <laughs> Listen, you, know this, you know what this is? This is all tactics, man, to, to distract you, man, from the league, you know, the, the title race. It's, it's what you're doing. At the start, he was trolling you a lot. Now he's taking you through Denver. You know what I mean? He's trying to distract the Arsenal fan base, man. I'm telling you, look at his smile now. Man. I'm telling you, this I'm is all not, I'm not, I'm not, I hate. <laughs> I, I hate the Arsenal fan base with a passion, but I'm actually spit like what I'm saying is is like it's got like maybe five percent agenda to put pressure on, and ninety percent, like ninety five percent, what I'm genuinely thinking, honestly. Mm. We'll see in his prediction, more. won't we? We'll see. What does yeah. my prediction have to do with anything? That I, I, <laughs> what does my prediction have to do with any of this? I said they have to go there and win. I didn't say I think they're gonna win. <laughs> let me look up on this all right people hit the like button let me see how many likes we're on because i haven't even checked this whole time now let me quickly check let me quickly check what are we on no we passed a thousand big up let's get to two thousand. we've got 5.4k in the building so we should oh, be able natural to natural love oh natural come on come on and like, yo, I, don't know why, I don't know why people are calling me t, t diddy you need to cut that shit out that's not that's not funny no, 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 no. Stop calling me T Diddy, please. I don't want any association with anyone named Diddy in 2024. Stop it. Cut it out. Cut it out. Mm. Anyone who's anyone who Why calls are you in America when the same Diddy, time this is going on? Anyone calls mm. me anyone who calls me T Diddy. Oh, I'm jumping onto Saeed. YouTube now and I'm blocking you. Yeah? Mm. Stop. Don't play. Are you are you yeah? in his hideout? Are you are don't you helping him oh, escape? Saeed, are you helping him escape? Driver. What's going on, Toby? Are you helping I, him I, escape? Apparently he went to flipping. He, t- he jumped on a private jet aye, to Antigua aye, aye. and turned Are off his Are you his lawyer? Why would I be his lawyer? I'm not even a lawyer. That doesn't make sense. <laughs> you look like one. <laughs> no, they're saying, they're, they're, they're saying tapping combs. No, no, the chat's gone. <laughs> they're, saying, <laughs> gone mad. they're saying what? <laughs> tapping combs. <laughs> I don't know what that means, but whoever, whoever, whoever's saying it, take screenshots of them so I can block them. Red take card. screenshots. Take screenshots, Matisse. 
take screenshots. I'll, I'll block them. So I'll block them for you. I'll block them for you. I'm sending them off. Thank you. Thank you. Everybody send off, bro. Leave the chat. Leave the chat. Step thank away you, from you. your step away from your devices. Put your phones down, your iPads, your your, your tablets. Step away from your devices. You're watching the show now. Hands Yo, this free, show's, guys. Hands oh, free. This has gone free. sideways, man. Hands Yo, free. Hands serious, free. Di- serious yeah. game, man. This is a deciding game. Look what we got. Yeah. Look, stop, stop, Wild. stop. This is all Wild. part of the tactics, man. I'm telling you. Hey, man. Stop. <laughs> we need to put some pressure on Arsenal and City here, man. Stop. Mm. So you don't want me to go to super chats? You still want to try? No, no, no. Go super chats. Go super chats. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Let's go. We must. Making sure. Just making sure. Um, let me work from. Let me get the ones in people for Arsenal. Like I said, hit the like button. Make sure you subscribe. Big up Opta, especially Opta Five, Opta Games, few games there. I explained it all already. There's a link in the live chat. Show them some love. They're showing us some love. That's how the, you know, the world goes round. People in the, in the YouTube world. Um. And yeah, like you've seen the pre-recorded content we've got coming out recently. You've seen the levels up in terms of editing and you saw the, the meetup. Well, yeah, you might not have saw it yet, but you saw the meetup last week. So we've got big plans for content and, you know, sponsors and collabs with brands like Opta. They help a hell of a lot. So I'll show them some love. It's a free game. You can even win cash. So helping us can win you some cash. Why not? Why not? Um, here we are. Let's start. As long as we win against Brighton and Arsenal win is the best result for Liverpool. City four points behind and level with Arsenal with nine to go. I back us all day in that shootout. Liverpool fan there, obviously, big part to play. I was watching the disrespect. City clapped Bayern and Madrid when it mattered in the Champions League last season. Mm, it is mad. It's true. It's true. Uh, Hamza says, man who aren't in the title race, quote, it's good to take part. Matisse, who will you support if, when you finish in double digits again next season? Bowley in. Uh, I'm just talking in, from experience. Most of, you know, yourselves wouldn't have remembered what it was like when Arsenal won the title. I, thankfully, was, you know, very much aware of my surroundings when we won titles. So I'm just telling you how it is like, you know, just be involved, you know, be a part of it, be amongst it, enjoy it celebrate it it's good that's what i'm cherish, you know cherish, cherish these it. moments yeah because you like because now i'm now i'm mid-table you can't just guarantee a title race like it doesn't like, come around every day do you know what i mean something to enjoy get amongst it yeah man shut your bitch ass up man nobody wants to hear from you you're, you're like 11th man who the fuck are you your bitch ass what up, the fuck man? have you done what the fuck have you turn done your, turn your cam bro. turn your camera off yeah go on mute and let grizz or let grizz Hugh and, and Bro, Turkish talk how about do you, how you, do you, you sit amongst these you sit in the dark sit in the dark how do you sit among, how, I don't know how you twice a week sit and uh, sit amongst these juggernauts and still chat absolute nonsense bruv yeah your team is shit bruv was in the past was now will be in no, the no, future no, 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 so no, don't talk to no, me no 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 we're not shit yeah? we're, we're not we're not shit you're shit you're shit you've shit. accomplished nothing bro. Do you know what i'm saying absolutely that's nothing. fine you're, don't you're tell still me shit. nothing you're still shit yeah don't tell me that you're still shit you're still shit say that to me you're still shit you're still shit turn the camera on or turn your camera off, sorry, and go go make it some Horlicks or something, man. Let let let. Bro, turn, turn, your, turn, your, turn your camera you landscape. One, turn, turn your camera landscape. How about that? How about you do that? <laughs> I'm good, brother. Oh, it's it's harder crazy. to hold a landscape. Go <laughs> make some Horlicks. It's all mad. Um, where are we? Paniotis says Arsenal beating City will be a massive upset. They're the underdogs. Pep never loses to sit. Pep never loses to title rivals at home. Just ask Klopp and Mourinho. It wouldn't be a massive upset. Of course, City are favourites. And we know why. Because they're probably the most dominant team at home in world football. The track record speaks for itself. But like I said, before the international break, and a lot of you scoffed at me when I said, in my humble opinion, Arsenal are playing some of the best football in Europe. Before the international break. Now, I don't know what the international when is, effect is going to be. When has your opinion ever been humble? But you've also said that they'll finish behind Liverpool. Mm. Maybe mm. first and second. Exactly. First and second. So you're going to finish above the team that are playing the best football? I'm mm. back. I'm, 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 that, that doesn't equate to results always, does it? Look what I said. I word it very carefully, brother. <laughs> They're playing the best football <laughs> in Europe. Hey. Is right. Arsenal were Close favorite. one there. Close one by many. Arsenal arguably have the smallest squad. Arteta trusts little to no one on the bench. This game is massive. I don't know, Shane. I think this year we've had a few goals off the bench. Um, 
So this season he's changed it up a, a little bit, in my opinion. Um, let me save this one loose. Um, I'll save that one. New says, obviously a win would be great, but reality of the situation is it's a must-win home game for City and it's a must-not-lose game for Arsenal at a tough away ground. Four points off both Liverpool and City is adequate work, in my opinion. Yeah, I mean, I, I, I agree with you there. I agree. Martorino says, Tob speaks on Arsenal with too much energy. All I hear is he is we have no world-class players, but now we must beat the European champs away with zero world-class players. I'll take a draw now. What does that what does that have to do with anything? We have no world class players, blah blah blah. What does that sorry now? They're I'm looking for else. sympathy. They're looking for very uh, like what's what's the word? What's the uh, word? Yeah, the, the word? What are they looking for? I get the I get the point he's trying to make, but yeah, come on man. Do better. Do better. I think it's a valid point. <laughs> mm. Listen, yeah. when Wes Morgan crashed it at the Etihad, bruv, there was no world-class players them days too. I remember that moment. I remember that Leicester, Rio Mares. Robert Hugh. No, but can I say something? Can I can I ask both the both the contenders or the participants this weekend? Can I ask you guys a question? If I offered both of you a draw now, guaranteed. No. Would you guys take it? No, no Turkey no. says. No. Fighter. Fighter, Huey, Come on, man. I expect Huey to say no, yeah. No, why would I take a draw? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Finally, Turkish not doing this fence sitting stuff anymore. I respect it. Still balanced, my brother. You can still call it a fence if you like, but I'm mm. not taking a draw. Mm. Mm. So Somebody want to take a draw. Okay. Grizz, Grizz is the only person on this panel that will take a draw. <laughs> <laughs> I'll take a draw. Cussy, cussy would. No I've been, I've been chopping and changing my mind about it. I've been chopping and changing what's the best result from a Liverpool point of view if we make sure we do the job versus Brighton. Otherwise, it's a long day. Long day if we don't do the job against I Brighton. I think it's but... a draw, to be honest. I think you have to take them both seriously now at this point to say mm. it's a draw. Mm. For Ten real. Games to go. Yeah. yeah. Big up Ryan as well. Big up as well for um, linking up last Friday. He said, Turks, just watch your AFTV with Robbie and James on my phone with this on the TV. Glad you stopped Robbie's speech. Thank the Lord. Arsenal need to beat City. Yeah. Robbie Did he try to do this? Was, this? Again. was Robbie pretending he's Arsenal again? fans. All over the world. The I, had to, well, I had to stop him. I had to stop him. I had to stop him. It's on video. Yeah, anyway. Oh, is it? Is it uh, like, I don't know how this has been. Done. I'm going to watch that. I'm going to watch yeah. that when I get past. Scary. Say no more, say no more. Where are we? Ziggy says, do we have to win to stay in the race? No, but the boost to our mentality and momentum would be massive. We only get this opportunity once, therefore we must. Big up the panel, best show around. And that is the mentality that they, that, you know, don't get it mm. twisted. Like, as much as the, the whole you must thing goes around, it's banter and, you know, pressure and all that. That's. I hope the players are, are looking at it like we must. I hope Arteta's looking at it like we must. That's how they should be looking at it. At, that them, you know, as fans, obviously, it's a bit different. You know, you you believe, you hope, you pray, and and you can be confident because I am confident. But you also know that, you know, there's it's Man City, the best team in the world. There's they're at home, but the players need to go on with that whole. This is it now. You know, we can do the job against City. That's why I wouldn't take a draw because I'm hoping that's how. They are looking at it and Arteta's looking at it. I want us to go for it as much as I I expect City to go for it. Um, until I see the lineup on Sunday, Stones Walker playing the injury news is just mind games. Oh, yeah. Yeah, I know what you mean there. We'll find out. Ryan again says the Shoreditch link up for the streets was litty. Turks, this is a must win game and I think we have to take the game to City. Rea, Rice, Saliba, Gabs, Saka, and Martinelli, all vital. Literally took the words out of my mouth. Blue Moon says, I think we do what we always do to the Arsenal. 4-1 to me. I can't see Turk's team doing out. Will Saka outdo our kid Foden? We must. <laughs> hey, Blue mm. Moon. Last That's an seven, interesting battle. Foden mm. and Saka's names in there, man. Stop forcing mm. it. It's all good. <laughs> Um, it's a massive game, but nothing is decided on Sunday. There's a team involved, there's a third team involved too. We are also playing the best team with no world class players, but now we have to win. Come on, guys. Well, obviously, you built on well, that was a super chat before the last super chat. Shane said, Toby, anyone coming in will face a challenge regardless who it is. Liverpool will give him time. 
not a ton of top managers out there that was going back to the Javi Alonso. I agree with the first point. Anyone coming in is going to have a tough time. I agree. Fully agree. Big up Turkish and the rest is Sahib. Would have loved to debate Tobes. Time ran out, but don't worry. Quote, we will be there. Love meeting you all. So kind. Big up. Come on, Sahib. Hope you're good, my bro. And there's gonna it's gonna be much more, plenty more of those. Um, big up Aston. Hope you're good, my bro. And hope hopefully we link up in the summer tour. Title talk, he says, for everyone, what are each contender's greatest strengths and weakness? And to the title contenders, why will you win the title? Cut those promos. <laughs> My man's coming in like, like Eddie Hearn or something. He wants us to go and what? Who's the first question for? Greatest strength and weakness. Matisse, what's Arsenal's greatest strength? <sighs> oh, Jesus. Um, <laughs> I would say... I would say the fans. It's the fans. Yeah, yeah. The fuck, how the fuck did you like that one? It's a very political answer. I say the fans. <laughs> They've always been nice to me, even though I've not been nice to their club. They were they were very nice to me at the meetup. So I say the fans. Biggest strength. If you guys can get behind Bomba. the team, you create that atmosphere, that ruckus, that noise. You can go anywhere, mate. You can go to the stars. So yeah, the fans. The fans are the best. Love them. The fans. Saeed, what's City's biggest strength? <laughs> City's biggest strength is Pep Guardiola, man. You know what I mean? Let's be honest. You know what I mean? This guy's a genius, so I'd say him. Pep Guardiola. Tom, what's, what's Liverpool saying, man? What's, what kind of vlog doing? is this, bruv? Where's his... He's, he's gone from portrait to now sideways. <laughs> <laughs> this guy, man. Um, <laughs> and to title contenders, why will you win the title? I don't think anyone's going to, yeah, be, be putting too much on the line tonight anyway. Because it's still so bad. Should. Go on, then you're the well, you're the one that's been avoiding saying your favorites for weeks. Yeah. Now you want to cut promos? Because we're not. What do you mean, bro? You're meant to cut a promo. Here you go. Let's go. Why are Liverpool going to win the title? Three, two, one. Grids, go. Why you put me on the screen like that? As if I said anything of the sort. <laughs> Come on, man. Respect the super chat, man. <laughs> <laughs> bro, I you think, just I said think, you okay. want us to... no, 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 rewind, select that man. Bring it back, man. Bring it back. Oh, oh okay. You're gonna super chat. It, bring yeah, up the super chat so I can address it accordingly. Bring up the mm. super chat, please. Oh wait, wait, wait. The super chat's gone, so we're just. Gonna oh, is it gone? Okay. So my my clubs or my team's greatest strength is for sure the manager, the dynamism, the motivation, the energy that he brings. I think it's fair to say that we're not our strongest. Um, I think it's fair to say Arsenal are the strongest. Um, <laughs> upgrade, yeah, 2024, yeah? Okay, I, I like it, I like it. Bring it, bring it. But yeah, I think our strength and energy comes from our coach. Um, I'd say we're still second favourites behind City, but this, this weekend could be pivotal. Uh, obviously, it could be mad pivotal if we don't do the job. But if we'd managed to do the job and there's a draw in the other game, then yeah, this could be a pivotal weekend in the title race. You see? Boo that. He wanted, he wanted you to say, why will Liverpool win the title? Bro, just swerved the whole question there. He said, our greatest strength is Jurgen Klopp. Said, if, no, if, if, Gris, if Gris did, pre strength, goes, if Gris did press strength? conferences, I'm telling you. I You're can so imagine it now. trained, we need to, You know what we need to do? We need to get Gris, the same green screen I've got, put it behind him, get all of the, the Liverpool sponsorships and all of the press conference stuff behind him. And yeah. it, it's just going gonna, gonna to work. And have, you I'm noticed, you know the, have you noticed it's the beautiful. coaches take a sip of water before they answer yes, the question? Yes, yes. Bro, I'm telling yeah, you, no. I, we can get you a little um, Liverpool, um, you know, branded mic cover. Oi, listen, next season, man, next season. We got it. We got it. Contents. We got it. It's time. Content. I agree with you, killing me. I think that's oh. it on the subject, if I'm not mistaken. This one says Grizz. No, that's Liverpool. We'll save that one. Save that one. Last one. Actually, wait. Yeah, big up to the man. There may be time. Come on, Deanie. Great vibes last Friday. No long thing. All right, big up, Deanie. Arsenal, Tobes, speak soon. Big up, Deanie, man. Big up. Oh, my. Um, love for coming through last week. I want City to humble Arsenal. Their fans they didn't win in the last 20 years, but they have chests like Peaky Blandon, Draft Best. 
he nearly lost me, mate. He really lost me. But we moved. Same, and Grizz are the best draft teams anyway. I'll take that. And draft best teams, Grizz and Hugh. Okay. Okay. That, to be honest, it's, it's, it's so mad the, the different votes for that, what people think for those teams. It's, I think maybe we do the FIFA thing to. To yeah, find it's all over the place, isn't it? Of, there's no consistency. There's a lot of people that, you know, if you, they don't like you, they just don't rate your team. Like, you can not like me, but how can you not rate my team? No, <laughs> I'm a prick. Don't <laughs> like me. I thought you're hate the community, you. man. Can't be no, a prick. No, no, no. There's certain, there's certain people that just got hate for each one of us. We all got haters. It's not just me, guys. Like, relax. <laughs> you all got haters. None of you like Mother Teresa's. But what never I'm seen, saying... Never seen one. But, but what, you know what we should have done, guys? Big mistake. Oh, we Mother done Teresa. That. You know what we should have done? No, we couldn't have done that as well. But basically, what I'm saying is they're rating us as opposed to our teams. Some people. Well, people. Are you mad? Drogba mm. Suarez. Are you mad? Drogba and Suarez yeah, up front. I was, either, I was either bottom of everybody's picking or top. And no way. Oh, the thing is, man, Grizz, we've all got legends, so we can all say, are you mad? And name off our front three. I've got Henri, what? Beckham and Hazard. Do you know what I learned? Ridiculous I don't think Beckham in there is, is, is illegal. Mm. Do you know what I learned? Xabi Alonso it's is illegal. A very you got Van Dyke and Company centre half, heading the ball specialist. Yeah. Goals galore from set pieces. I've, I've learned. Beckham in there, guys. He, he sneak Beckham in there. I've learned this generation, they don't respect Xabi Alonso. I don't know what he did to them. I remember Van Zabi Alonso, man. Van Zabi Alonso, man. You don't know him anymore. Fraud, fraud. He's part of your Champions League winning team. He's too slow for the Premier League. Too slow for the Premier League. Man, never wanted him. Very disrespected. Crazy. Yo, it's not spoilers, in it, man. Get on this. Why have you seen it already? People saying spoilers. Why it's been out for four or five hours. Why not? Have, why have you guys not watched the videos? How is it spoiled? Oh, it's yeah. nearly twelve hours. You didn't now. watch it when you was at work today, really? Okay. You should have notifications on. <laughs> Wagwan. That's good though. It's good. That's good. <laughs> Followed up saying not enough chests for your title bids. Come on, big up the panel. Best to ever do it. Not yet. Not yet. Not yet. But like like Chris said, come Monday, might we might be you know a couple of us might be feeling different. Um. Grizz, you gotta get some chest, my guy. You chat like what Accrington Stanley or something. Were you afraid of? I don't see Accrington Stanley uh, finishing second behind the greatest team of everything. I said we we battle. I had the most chest. I didn't see you X X X one one V V V I X C C one 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 at the start of the season predicting that. <laughs> How can you come to me? I had the mostest chest, and I'm still sticking to my prediction. I ain't changing. I don't get carried away, man. You want mm. me to get carried away? Not to be me. fair, he did say if Liverpool beat City, then things would change. And, and we did it. So, did it. Yeah, we man, must, it is, Saeed. Me, do you know what? Grizz has been very consistent. I, I will say that. He's we been did very, don't Not transfer-wise, but in terms of this, very consistent. Very yeah. consistent. Yeah. Man said not transfer-wise. Yeah. When we must, we didn't must, as my brother <laughs> says. Uh, that's it for <laughs> the super chat. <laughs> on that subject, I will... Getting other super chats later on. This is kind of on it. I said, given the unlikelihood, I want to see Matisse and Turkish skydive streaming bald if Havertz scores the winning goal for the Champions League or the Premier League. Sign the thing. I'm, I'm here. Skydiving. I mean, I, I talked about that with someone else recently. I don't know whether it was Matisse or whether it was Skull or it's something we've we've got in mind for maybe a forfeit or or something. Anyway, are you saying uh, Chris is going to do skydiving at the end of the season? <laughs> we're we're going to keep Grizz alive for next season, man. We need to think of something that's going to... No, kill me, innit? Kill me. Let's <laughs> 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 say kill me for finishing bottom of the table. Go on, do it. <laughs> oh, man. <laughs> <laughs> Finish me off, man. Yeah. <laughs> no, we're good. Finish him. Good. Finish him. <laughs> if I knew it was that serious, bro, I would have been paying much more attention from the start. <laughs> <laughs> Same, bro. Same. <laughs> 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 ah, let's do prediction. He started off a laugh and a joke, and you man's are looking to dead me now. <laughs> nah, but the, the, the gummies or the or that or that chip would have deaded you anyway. So we're trying to think of something different. We're trying oh, to think God. of something. I think I can handle the gummies, bad. you know. I think I can handle the gummies, you know. No, you know what I want you to do? You know what I can handle it, you know. I'm gonna I'm gonna I've got one I've, I've got a list of things, yeah. I can't lie to you. One one of the things in the list, yeah. I'm not trying to dead him off or nothing. So one of the things on the list, you know them just stop oil people. 
I can't allow one grid to wear a high vis and, and sit in the middle of the road in Central, yeah, and just stop watching traffic. Wow. <laughs> that would be so... That would be mad. No. That would be mad. That would go viral. That no, would be on the Plastics alone. That would go viral. Fucking Sky News. Just stop oil. Yeah, <laughs> stop man. more traffic. <laughs> So you can get reefed out of the road by some fellow on an SUV. <laughs> That's crazy. That's why I would have to be there though, to help because because man can't manhandle Uncle Chris. They tell me none of that. But it wouldn't be one person would be enough though, man. Just you stop, have to get like a team of people. The big six. That's what we should do. Just stop the just big send Toby six, with him, man. Yeah, just, just stop the big six. Five. But you know what though? I big up the man. <laughs> but you know what it is though? It what you, you know what I mean? Like it is true. Like in terms of the brand management, that would be crazy, but. Yeah, we want to look out for Grizz, man, because there's no, some people you know out there, you know what I'm saying? <laughs> no, do you know what it needs to be? Just stop the oil, brothers. <laughs> Ooh. And then me and Hugh, me and Hugh, <laughs> just somewhere there. Because obviously he's Liverpool fan. Somewhere there, you know. do it the right way, yeah. If Man City win the league, especially, that's the perfect way to do that. It's just stop the oil, brothers. Yeah, that's yeah, crazy. yeah, yeah. That's just, a hint. that's just a hint of things that I have on my list. That's all I'm saying. Um, big up Aura as well. I right, Aura, is that this? Yes, it is. Big up. Yeah, man, big up Aura, man. And he gifted 20 big six memberships as well. Come on, my guy. Love for the love. Come people. on. 20 out there. Grab it if you can. Um, Big up everyone that's become a member. Big up everyone that linked up last week. Really appreciate it. And now we move on to Super Chats, I believe. We move on to Super Chats. Yes. Um, Not Super Chats. Predictions. What am I saying? Predictions. Yeah. All right, let me bring up the prediction table just to remind people of the order. I have deducted myself one point because I was late that day um, and I did check that after 10 minutes is one point, after 20 minutes is two, after half an hour, I, I mean, after 20 minutes, it's, the, it's all three. And I was between 10 and 20 minutes late. So there we are. And you all forgot about it, to be honest. So I really, I did think to myself, should I just fucking put my point back on? But I said, no, nah, let me just leave it. So Tobes, <laughs> top. Saeed, second. I'm in third. Matisse in fourth. Hughes in fifth. Grizz is in sixth. Tobes, first Damn. up. He is here, but I've got his predictions. I say he's Tobes here barely. Clear, um, we, need to, we need to deduct points off him today because he's gone clear. No, that he's under investigation. That, that hasn't yeah, he's definitely when, got to be under investigation. Yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah. Seven points. Need, I need some deductions, you know what I'm saying? Seven points, you know what I'm saying? For, for, just call it for breaching Big Six protocol or something. Just yeah, send him to CAS, man. Send him to the Court of Arbitration. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, 100%. Send it to where they get city and that. Yeah. Uh, Tobes, are you there? Are you aware? Are you... <laughs> You're a funny guy, Saeed, man. You're a funny guy. <laughs> See, if you get yeah. Garrett Southgate, Saeed, I'm going to laugh oh, so much. Oh, no. So fucking listen, hard listen. you. No. <laughs> Garrett Southgate, you. Gary O'Neill, the old Trafford dream team. I can imagine the day yeah, Southgate gets a hired and Saeed's first video. Gareth Southgate, out! <laughs> Bro, <laughs> I'm done, <laughs> man. We didn't even get it over. <laughs> season ticket handed over, mate. That's me. That means for, for how long he's there, I'll hand over a season ticket. Yeah, well. Three, four years. Ah, right, listen, <laughs> Tom just, he's struggling. So I've got his predictions. He keeps on trying, but I'm, yeah, I'm tired. Um, he's gone with 2 1 Man City. So that's Tobes' prediction. Saeed, you're up next. I've gone for Desmond. Two, two. I'm going for a 2-1 Arsenal win. Uh, Matisse. Uh, 2-1 City. 2-1 City. You? Time to rise, man. Time to rise. This is where the shark gets active. 3-1 City. 3-1 and Grizz. I think 1-1. I think one, one. No, we're what you want. That'd mm. be perfect for him. That's what you want. Mm. So, to round it off, Saeed and Grizz have gone for draws. Saeed 2-2, two, two, Grizz 1-1. One, one. I'm the only one that's gone for an Arsenal win. 2-1, Tobes and Matisse have gone 2-1 the other way. Man City and Hughes gone for a 3-1 City win. That's all of the predictions in. We'll publish on the socials. And we keep it moving. Hour and a half in. The show just flown by tonight. We've still got four fixtures. I wouldn't say to talk about because there's not much to talk about in the four fixtures. But we've still got four to predict. And we've still got about half an hour left of the show. Still 5.4k here. Show some love. Hit the like button. Make sure you're subscribed. Individual channels. Opta. Big up. Link in the live chat. Link in the description. If you're watching after, we'll pin a comment as well. People, go show up to some love. It's a free-to-play game. Opta 5. 
there's a couple of us there cash prizes week in week out and they help us do the pre-recorded stuff makes sense people love for the love next up let's just get liverpool brighton in now because we just talked about city arsenal grizz should get the job done a couple hours before the big kickoff on sunday um should really put the pressure on us that's the name of the game that's the plan um uh, plans don't always go to uh to plan <laughs> but uh but yeah we must there's no uh there's no sitting on the fence or if in and batting we must must put the pressure on it's the least we can do anyhow we drop points against brian who people will know and you guys will probably know as well have given us a hard time in recent years for some reason they come to anfield and play ball um so it's not going to be straightforward obviously we Obviously, after the international break, it's going to be a matter of, let's see who we can get back fitness-wise. I don't think there's anyone returning this weekend. But I know Curtis Jones and Trent and Jota are a matter of a couple of weeks away, max. Um, but yeah, we, we've got to put Brian to the sword. I don't. It's not one of those games where I'm looking for a performance or goals or anything. I'm looking for three points because, you know, if there's any any way... Yeah, it, it's, it's the minimum. It's, it's the minimum to do. Like, obviously, people are saying we need to score lots of goals and put that kind of pressure on Arsenal because Arsenal got goal difference um, of about five, six more than us, I think. Yeah. Um, but I'm not about that life. I need to just get the win and then maybe address it in the Sheffield United at home, hopefully, um, game. This is not a game for trying to match goal differences. This is a game to get three points and then sit back and enjoy the, the massive game that's going to follow us. So, yeah, it's a must. We absolutely must. Yeah, yeah, I get it. Yeah, you must, for sure. There's not much more to say on it. You're home, Brighton. I feel, I feel if, like Brighton... I just want to pose the question. If hmm. Liverpool were to drop points in that Brighton game, how, how much bigger do you think our game becomes? If Liverpool were to drop points in that game... I can't. Yeah, it, add, it definitely adds an extra edge. It becomes bigger for sure. I'm tempted to say it becomes even bigger for Arsenal because Arsenal. then we'd actually, you know, lead. Daylight. Lead. You put daylight between us. A little daylight. A little daylight. But if Man City equally, they'd, they'd go top of the league with a win at Etihad if, if Liverpool don't, don't beat Brighton as well. So it'd just if be you, that. Full, if, you, if you beat us, if you, sorry, if we drop point, let's say we get a draw um, and you beat City. Or one of you wins. What's the points difference? You'd be if second. You point. If you get a point, you go a point ahead in the title in the, in the lead. If City win, they go a point ahead of you, two points ahead of us. But if we win, we go two points ahead of you, four points ahead of City. Mm, my brain can't compute that that quickly. Yeah, I think I'm right anyway. It sounds sound. No, you are right. You are right. Um. Yeah. 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 yeah we don't. We don't do maths in mid table. So I don't know what you're saying. <laughs> you're, gonna be doing, you're gonna be doing maths of a different 40 kind points you're, you're, you're gonna, you're gonna be doing you just know 40 maths. just 40 yeah 40 have you got 40 by the way have you got 40, 40? no nope. oh, still waiting yeah, yeah still waiting <laughs> i was no. like, thinking last season i was running it as a joke i'm not even joking this season i'm just leaving it like you are such 40. bums man you are such bums <laughs> thank you i didn't i didn't know that it's thank you very it's, much. it's nearly april you haven't hit 40 but listen uh, you didn't beat these bums this season and don't don't not beat us i know that's why i hurt so much well. you're such bums <laughs> we haven't beat you we got, yet. you got we got you in the fa cup semi-final as well bro <laughs> yeah, we'll speak. Yeah, I mean, talk soon. <laughs> talk soon. Talk soon. Yeah, yeah. Mad. Um, no super chats on the subject, but we had one here earlier from Violins in the chat saying, "More move over, Saeed, and your world-renowned emergency meetings." Grizz Khan moving mad, putting Liverpool players on trial this week on football carnage. The same players who had to be put in all the combined 11s a few weeks earlier. Who's been on trial? Ah, so trial. Content, man. I don't know what, what, what he's trying to say. Like, I don't know what he's trying to say. Like, we've done some content on my channel and we said, like, you know, put them on trial and what, who survives the cup? Normal he was on trial. Mm. Huh? Elliot. Was man, Elliot every, on man, trial. Every, every player in the squad. Oh. Get it. Oh. Elliot Stand did like... an incredible game against um, Luxembourg under 21. Did you see the clips? Yeah, man. Incredible. What? Incredible, what man. The I skill. Mean, this, he, he deserves to be in the squad for that. 
He was taking the yeah. piss out of them players. It was very rude. Believable, I've seen, man. I've seen your video, um, Saeed, uh, been circulating about Liverpool players comparing them to Kobe Mainu. I, I, I know what you've done with Kobe Mainu. And you haven't learned. You haven't learned nothing. Oh, I haven't learned five, nothing. Four or five <laughs> years, I've four or five years, I've met you and and, and listened to you, and you haven't learned mm. anything. So you've done it again. I mean, my my you, my, my you thing have, came from the fact that you you sound like you're disappointed, like, 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 like oh, older parent. Or, yeah, yeah. Listen, I'm, sometimes I'm listen to the, me. Always, I didn't say refuse. anything. You refuse. <laughs> Your whole yes. Liverpool fan base has spent the past three days <laughs> crying while Elliot. And Jones are not in the squad. Not I don't, I don't give a shit. Anything. I don't give a oh, shit. Wow. Well, sort your, sort your fan base out there. No, we've got you the clips ready. Because so that's he, all so he's clips. really running with this Kobe Manu hype, ready, man. I've seen him on about eight different shows ready. gassing up this Manu versus nah, man. We've got the clips Listen. ready. We've got the clips ready. Manu, 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 Manu's, Manu's cold. Manu deserves to be gassed. Manu's cold. Yeah, man. 100%. But you, man, are doing you're doing comps against Luxembourg under 21s. Have some shame. Whoa. You, you, see, you, don't, <laughs> Whoa. Kids. Whoa. It's not shush. It's, it's <laughs> stop. You're, those are kids. You're a grown ass man. Wow. There's a I'm difference. just saying. Nah, he's good. Be... I'm just saying. Kids but I don't get I don't get clips. Kids doing I'm comps about players. Online and lots of better way. You know what I mean? 21. Comps. That's what I'm saying. Kids but why are you comps comparing about yeah, Elliot? Yeah. No, he's, he's, he's doing it. Why do you compare him? Tobes, have you seen Liverpool fans being salty, saying, why is Kobe Mino playing for the England? Why is it when Elliot's been mashing up work? That's what I see online. Oh, yeah, it's man. not you, Grizz, but that's what I see. So that's no. where I came and I said, Liverpool has this a chill. Take a chill pill and relax. Your ball is balling. I don't, I don't get it for Elliot. I, I don't get it for Elliot. Elliot is good, though, but I don't get that that rationale of should he be in the England squad. I don't get it for Elliot, even though he is very like, well, he's talented. You, you, I get yeah. it for you just have Jones, to look though. at the People playing in Elliot's Jones. position, right, is Saka, Cole Palmer, and Foden. And I'm sorry, he's not had a better season than Bowen. those guys. And Bowen. And Bo yeah, four, he's not had a better season than those guys, if we're being objective. There you go. He's not, he's not, he's not, he's not he's not always starting. Jones is different. For me, Jones has probably been, you yeah, know, Jones, right yeah. with McAllister and, and Endo. But he's you been guys started. got it wrong. I, I genuinely don't care. It's like, yeah, I know you don't. Energy I know you don't. Coming from me. Like, I don't want to yeah. play for England. But if you ask me for a debate purpose... Like if Curtis Jones deserves it ahead of Kobe Mainu, then yes, he I does. rate Kobe I agree. Mainu a lot. I think Kobe Mainu is the is the truth. I do rate him, and you guys, Said, remember we said on the on your post match, yeah, I said, yeah, yeah bro, you got a player yeah, there. Yeah. You got a player there. But Curtis Jones, like that's a debate, but I don't care. Like, yeah, man, play for England. Okay. Play for England. Yeah, yeah. Get boosted by Said. I've got the video already. Said's called him some mad stuff already. I've not. I've not. But go on. And Vitsu said he's here to start war. Mainu versus Elliot, Palmer versus Saka. No. Ruined it with that last one, but we moved. <laughs> <laughs> we moved. Um, okay. Uh, predictions, I think. Tobes, uh -huh. I've got your prediction here. You look like you're I'd like to I'd like to say my prediction though. Yeah, well be my guest. So who's this? This is Liverpool. Liverpool? Yeah. Yeah. So Liverpool we Brighton 3-1 three, 3-1 one. Three, one. Saeed mm, I'm going to go with 2-0 Liverpool 2-0 two, 2-0 no. two, no, Liverpool I'm going to go with two, two. Wow. Oh, 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 oh. Yo, yo, <laughs> you just abandoned the league, yeah? Okay. Turkey's a madman. Roski, we'll see, man. Fingers crossed, man. You know, what can we do? Matisse. Yay. Um, I'm going to go 4 1 Liverpool. You're, you're misbehaving. I'm not. You keep, you've said this to me before, and then what happened? You slapped them up. So, remember Brighton, they're very, they like to play games, play stupid games, win stupid prizes. They like to play out from the back and you press them and then, yeah, stripping us. Yeah. You're going to win. You're going to win. You. Robertson still out. Yeah, Chris, how long is he out for? Mm. This game, definitely. Uh, I'll go 2-0, Liverpool. Chris. 1-0. 
Oh, you're 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 being so silly. One nil. You don't think more than one goal in this game? Two attack-minded teams. Oh, you're getting relegated, bro. You're finished. You need that <laughs> opting. You better, yeah. You better start doing the opting. Is that opting? You. <laughs> yeah, you're finished. You're finished. <laughs> you're finished. You are finished. You need to. Ah, cool. That's all the predictions. In <laughs> all wins, apart from me going with a two-two draw. Um, what made you go with a two-two draw? Here we go. That's his opinion, man. What? No, no, I'm not. I'm not judging him. I'm just asking him the rationale. I'm not taking the piss. Just a mix of hope, and I'm sure. I'm sure Brighton have have done well against Liverpool. If I'm not mistaken, yeah, they have. They have? They have. Last yeah. season, yeah, they blamed them three yeah. 0 uh, Oh yeah. Oh yeah. yeah. Is that the one where Joe Gomez? Where, yeah, where, we're uh, shaking, Mat- shaking. Mat- Mat- he turned Joe Gomez into Ice Spice. Peak. Yeah, it's, been a redemption. it's been a redemption. Yeah, I'm, 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 so far, so I was just about to say that. I was just about to say that. I'm really happy with the turnaround because I, I do yeah. like Joe Gomez. I think he's a good player, but yeah, that was mad. <laughs> that's it. Yeah, that's my rationale. Hope, pray, and yeah, Brighton do their thing. All right. Next up, next up, we move down to the top four conversation and we might as well start Tottenham Luton. Tobes. Not much coming true needed. Just win the game of football, man. We're in that mode now where, like, we need wins. Wins, 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 wins. Just win the game of football. Um, that Fulham result was crazy, man. Absolutely crazy. That was a freshen. And make no mistake, we're going to have a tough game against Luton. Like, uh, I'm under no pretenses as to how difficult they can make a game of football be. But at home, man, come on. you got to do away with Luton. You have to. We, we, we need to win that game of football because... I'm not sure who we play next week. I think so. No, we play Luton, then we play Nottingham Forest, and then I think after that we travel away to to Newcastle. Man, we need to try and build some momentum again. We have to start back up again because we lost to Fulham, but start back up again. Try and get two, three wins straight before you enter the crunch fixtures against uh, your Man Cities, your your Arsenal's, and your Liverpool's. Man, so yeah, just win, just win. There's not much to it than that. Simple as. Might as well just move straight on to predictions, Scott. Yeah, I'm going to go for a clean sheet. You know, I'm going to go for 2 0. I think we'll, it's going to be a hard fought 2 0. 2 0. Saeed. I'm going to go for 3 1 Tottenham. Yeah, that's what I've gone for 3 1 Tottenham. Uh, Matisse. Um, Tottenham. Yeah, 3 1 as well. Start copying people. Q? 2-0 Tottenham. 2-0. And Grizz. Oh, is it in North London? Yeah, no. it is. Yeah, it is. It's no, it's, 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 both teams it's, are in North London, no? It's, it's at, it's at um, Argo. No, Luton's not in North London. Either. We don't claim them. Saeed, Saeed's trying to bamboozle you, bro. <laughs> what are you drinking? Um, mimosa. <laughs> I thought oh, you said okay. that because he's not making sense or something. <laughs> no, I'm making I'm making perfect sense. What do you mean I'm not making sense? <laughs> no, I thought that's what you meant. <laughs> that mimosa's gone to your head. I thought you said I thought you said a send for you. <laughs> what? I thought you said a send for you. When are you going to bring back pina coladas, man? I'm actually missing them now. That was your brand. You know what? You know what? You know what? Um, when they get if... the top four, in it can celebrate. Yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah. Okay, when we fair, when fair. when we seal that, I'll I'll bust them out. Yeah, fair, they're not fair, coming fair. out then. <laughs> <laughs> Grizz, that's how you're gonna do me. All right, fair enough. <laughs> fair enough, brother. I remember that, yeah. Oh, <laughs> yeah. Up, Mr. Goosey says, "Nice to meet all of you in Shoreditch, and thanks for the banner. We'll be using it for the North London derby." Toby has the same energy on camera and off. We must beat Luton. Need momentum for the big games. Pleasure meeting you, my bro. Um, Imagine we up. see one of those banners in the stadium. Like someone brings it to the stadium and hangs it off. The, yeah, the yeah, yeah. That, that would be sick. <laughs> that would be actually cold, mm. yeah. Hey, you might as well go do that. Yeah, do that. He said he's going to do it. It sounds like he's there. Go put that out there, man. It'll, it'll actually catch eyes as well because the colours are good on it as well. People are probably wondering what banner. Yeah. Content coming That's out. That's a bit of promo for us as well, man. Big up. Yeah. Yeah, this one, this one came in earlier from Sakti saying, Nope, Tobes, not only does your net stink, your mana stink too for not bringing in another rep, but credit cry to him. more, man. Cry more, cry more. He's managed to, to be here for the majority. <laughs> yeah, that's it for Tottenham. Sorry, I just missed that. Did someone say use the banners at the stadiums to put them over the thing? 
Yeah. yeah. That would be cold. Very, very. You know how gassed mm. I would be if someone did that and it got on TV? Oh, my days, I'd be gassed. That yeah, would be, be so mad. sick. For real. That would be mad. <laughs> Well, look, he's got one there. He's the he's one of two to have one. So we'll yeah, see. man, you guys got to use that to your advantage, man. You guys are the flag flyers now. Trust me. Trust <laughs> me. Oh yeah, um, I wanted to quickly mention as well, right? Um, just in case we we got viewers who are at the Spurs game. So this Sunday when we play, um, there's gonna be like a minute's worth of a, like clapping for one of my friends, fiance, who passed away. So she passed away. She's 27 years old. So on the 27th minute. If you're at that game, Saturday the 30th of March, looting at home, 27th minute, we're clapping, right? We're clapping for Ellie. So, yeah, just wanted to put that out there. Spread the word, man. Yeah. There you go. Yeah, man. 27th minute, join in. Join in, show the love and support. Um, yeah, Porto with the family and that. Big up, Tobbs. Let's move. Next up, Man United away to Brentford. Yeah, man, big game, big game. The worst kickoff time as well, man. Has anyone cut Stundies at 8 p.m. on a Saturday, man? It's just Fucking jarring, man. Yeah. Isn't it? It's jarring, isn't it? Do you, do you know what's yeah, worse? Man. Do you if, know what's if you're worse? Going to the game, it's so good, man. It's so good if you're going. But if you're not going, it's it's dead waiting all day for it. Do you know what's worse? We got an email sent today to Spurs um, season ticket holders that the game against Nottingham Forest that was on Monday at 8, Oh yeah, been resp- yeah. Has yeah, been moved that. to Sunday at six PM because of the trains or something like that. So, yeah, yeah, I, yeah it's I, mad. I, it's mad. Yeah, I'm a fan of evening kickoffs. I, I do like evening kickoffs, but I would. I'm not going to that game anyway. But like, I feel like Sunday evening, you want to be rested up at home, chilling, man, yeah. watching stuff on TV. You don't want to be travelling at that time to go to football matches, man. Is yours on a Sunday night? Yeah. Yeah. No, no, Saturday night. Saturday night. Saturday night. Yeah, Saturday, Saturday, Saturday night, eight PM, night, so. good, man. That's how it's good. Go for the food. Anyway. Go but yeah, man, night game, out man. Listen, we need to get... Yeah. We need to get some sort of revenge, man. Because last... I don't know if you remember, but they beat us 4-0. You know what I mean? That famous second game from Ten Hag. Ronaldo was on the pitch. Hot summer's day. David De Gea, Haolo. Um, Maguire getting his pants pulled down. You know what I mean? They just ran riot, mate. I think... Was it 4-0 in the first half? Four. I think it was, you know. Yeah, it was. It was. 4-0. But, can I ask a question? No, sorry. I think it yeah. wasn't four 0 in the first half. But I want a question. How nah, were you saying? It was four 0 oh, It was. Okay. You know, it fair, was. Fair, I think fair. it was. Yeah. yeah, yeah. Four 0 first half an hour. I think. Yeah. How were you asking for revenge when you scumbagged three points of them this season? You were terrible for like eighty five percent of that care. game, and you won two one courtesy of a mistake from their goalkeeper as well. So if anything, Listen, they should be looking. They were they should be looking time. for revenge. They can hold that. No, they, were, nah, they were wasting they, time. They can hold that. They, they were wasting they can hold that, time. Still, now nah, they can hold that, bro. You know yeah. what it is, yeah. The, the amount of wasting time they were doing, it was ridiculous, bro. And I'm glad we won that game. You know, what I'm trying to say so. Them man can hold that, but for this one here, bro, them man got to remember that game because that hurt me, bro. That you know when you talk about the seven nils and you know that did hurt, yeah. But that four nil, it was a disgusting loss, man. It was awful. You know, what I mean, the way we got our pants pulled down, it was just no lack of, it was lack of leadership on the pitch. It was before Casemiro came. It was just like, it was awful, man. So, yeah, man. Is he going to play? Uh, please I tell me he's no, playing. No, I don't think he is. He's injured. He's injured. He's oh, injured. Man. He's injured, I think. Oh, yeah, man. I think he's injured. So, no Casemiro. I don't think Martinez touch and go if he's back. Hoyle is back, which is massive. I think, you know, just have a striker available. I think that's huge. Um, and obviously, Kobe Minoff doing his thing, you know what I mean, for England. So, carry on that form as well. It's going to be tough, man. But I think United should get over the line. Their defence here, listen, man, they've been leaking goals in. you know, And the way they've been leaking as well, been awful, man. So, if we can't score against Brentford or get a win, there ain't no hope. Yeah, they had a bit of a, a showing at Chelsea and they did their, be- their best and that. You know what I mean? They did their thing. But we got to win, man. We got to win, surely, man. We've got to win. Yeah, Mason Mount's back. You know what I mean? Mm. He's back. So, you know what I mean? Do, where does he start? I don't know. I don't think he starts, to be honest with you. I think he's a squad player now, and then we'll see how he gets into the team. But, yeah, man, we need to, we just need to win. Get the win and just see if we can somehow get to top four. Personally, for me, I don't see it because I feel like we just got to get our job done. But, you know, who knows, man? Got to get a run going, innit? So, yeah, that's pretty much it, really. Yeah, it's one of those ones where I... Yeah, I, th- I think Brentford might. 
might show up. You know, they, they tend to show up sometimes with a bigger game. Mm. Yeah. They've done it yeah. really. Yeah. I think mm. they got something. I, I, I do too as well. I think they got something cooking. I've been telling him he's feeling good about himself after scoring for England as well. Yeah. That's yeah. true. Yeah. That's very oh, true. Yeah, yeah, that's true. Yeah. Isn't Bremer back? I know he's back training, but is he match fit? Don't know, you know, man. I'd say they're they, mm, saying this. Yeah, I'd say, yeah, yeah but not starting, maybe. Maybe they might be yeah, off the bench. But I'm just guessing from the, the knowing that. Two and a half weeks ago, he returned to training. The thing, right. the thing that will probably encourage Man United is that defensively, Brentford have just been so wishy washy. That's what I'm saying. As of late, yeah. though, which is annoying me, but I think at home they they can definitely conjure up something for, for Man United. Is, then. is um any of your injured players back, Said? So Luke Shaw's not available. Um, Casemiro isn't available. Lissandro's 50 50, you know what I mean? But apart from that, I think, yeah, everyone's back. One Bissaka, you've seen him back. Mount's back. Yeah, it's just Lissandro, Luke Shaw, Casemiro. I'm not saying Mount going to start? might be out. Maguire might be out. Yeah, Maguire might be out. So who's that, sorry? Mount will be on the bench. Is he going to start? No, no, no. I don't know. For me, I don't know. Because of the dynamics, I don't know, you know. I doubt they'll put Kobe Miners in long six. Five million squad player, yeah? Bro, it's mad. Listen, bro. It's how you view him. I didn't see him that way. It's Max. I, I, I reckon the thing is, yeah, go on, side. Go on, yeah, go, go, on. On, go on, go on. Now, saying, um, he's gonna he's probably gonna come in on the left wing and the right wing. I think that's the best way he gets into this team, really. Do like on the wings, maybe kind of go and do it like that because I don't see him as playing the midfield. Where does he play? You've, you've signed a midfield, you dropped, you dropped Bruno, you dropped Bruno crazy. for a minute. Yeah, he dropped Bruno. Tell that to, to, to Ten Hag, mate. You know what I'm saying? No, like, that's like, you Bruno's can't play him man. That's Mount's crazy. Not a winger. That's Bruno, crazy. Bruno Fernandez is anything but undroppable. If you paid fifty-five million to play Mason Mount out wide, then I don't know what to say. I think that's Bro, what's going to be the plan. You, you tell me now, yeah? Okay, okay. So you got you got Kobe Milo, Bruno Fernandez, yeah. who are a mainstay in that midfield, right? Yeah. So you're going to have maybe McTominay as a double pivot alongside Manu. and that is it. That you, and even and McTominay, not that's not his position. McTominay, McTominay is, McTominay is terrible. Yeah, but he's, terrible. Gonna, he's not going to play Amrabat. He's not going to play Amrabat. I don't think so for me. But, but he was out. playing. But he was playing. But the thing is, he 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 does this double eights. He plays double eights. And yeah, that's what I'm saying. Your, he puts your number six on the island. So I would have thought he would play. He would play Mount. But then I guess maybe that means Mainu might have to play six when when Casemiro is not there. Which is nah, no chance. Yeah, I don't know, man. No chance. Uh, no. But no we said we said this in the summer, right? This signing, it's a, it's a terrible signing. Like we said it, and it's not like oh, Mount is a bad player or anything because I don't think he is a bad player. But where does he fit in this team? He Mount Mason Mount does not solve a single problem Man United had, not one problem he solves. Mm-hmm. And I, I, when you deep it, that's 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 the problem. And again, I want this, I don't want this to be misconstrued as oh, oh, you don't think he's a good player. I think at, at his best he is a good player. But what problem does he solve for Man United? He's not as creative as Bruno Fernandes, who is a detriment to the team when he loses the ball, right? He's yeah. not He's not going to get acres of goals and like lots and lots of goals and assists. Do you get what I'm saying? And he's not got the blistering pace to play out wide. Like, Mason Mount is what he was probably in his last few months at Chelsea, which is a rotation piece at a big club. He's not a 60 million marquee yeah. midfielder. And... Man United have now got 60 million. I hate million, to say I told you 60, so. 60, I hate yeah, to say you're I right, told you're right. So. I didn't want to be right, summer. by the way. We said it in the I, summer. I didn't want to be right. People are cussing yeah. you. I, re- I remember the streams where Bro, people were it. trying to come for you. Nonsense. Yep. It was Absolute obvious nonsense. to be fair. Wow. Like, you, you went from, Luke, um, you went from um, De Jong as your target to then getting um, like Mount in yeah. the mirror. It's very strange. Very strange. He changed the election. He changed it. Spot on. On. No, but you know what is here? I just, I just like, could we use the money a bit wisely? That was my kind of thing. Like, yeah, yeah if it's your, if it's your kind striker, of guy, on a uh, front line striker. Well, there you go. Yeah, or, or for me, another midfielder that can, that can maybe play on the, on the six, or, or, or can, you know what I mean? It's, it's a bit, it's a bit of a central midfielder. Man United, you know? exactly. So. You hit the nail on the head. Man United actually just gone out and spent that money on an actual central midfielder, someone who can take the ball from the first place phase, sorry, and progress it through the second phase. Like that's what they yeah. should have done. I don't. I, it was. Yeah. It wasn't rocket science. Honestly, it was not rocket science. So to go out and spend, for me, to go out and spend sixty million, fair enough. Let alone, Mason Mount is not even worth sixty million with, with four years left in his deal. They went out year. and spent. They went out and spent sixty million all in on Mason Mount with one year left 
on his deal coming off his worst season in a Chelsea shirt. That is an absolutely egregious bit of business. Terrible. Not absolutely to, not, terrible. What, 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 not to mention what, we also ran him into the ground as well, so he's injury prone. What's that word? Uh-huh. Egregious. Like, it's, it's disgusting. Egregious. Yeah, yeah, I know yeah. what he meant. I just, I just wanted to confirm what he meant, what he said. You know, I, I was saying Mount, it, it made most sense for him to go to Liverpool. It made most sense for him to go to Liverpool. Liverpool was always the club that would have made the most sense for him. Mm. Um, but for some for reason... Real. They don't need him. They, got well, they, the same about they don't Lavi need him now. They don't need him now, but they were looking at eight. They were looking at... Don't do that, man. Don't do that. It's, no, it's, it's, I, I get you, though. I get what you're saying, though. Look at the role that Sabozlai has played. That's where Mount could have played. He could have played that role. I agree. No. Do you want to be the better uh, signing, Mount or Sabozlai? No, don't on, shake man. your head. Yeah. Don't shake the your head. Hungarian Steven Gerrard. Ma- oh, Mason Mount. 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 There's not much yeah, between Mason the two. Mount's in from this what I've seen, like Sabozlai has not come into this league and well, done a madness. Can't be. Yeah, he can't be doing that. The Mount Hungarian is a good Gerrard. player. Sabozlai is a good yeah, player. Yeah, Sabozlai is not some some simple some madman. Yeah, let's do. You don't watch Sabozlai, man. You look. We were watching. We we no. Trust me. We we've been watching Sabozlai. We we been watching. We we been watching. We we been watching. We we been Trust me, we've been watching him this season stink out the stink out the drop. Serious stinkers this season. You know what it is? Because Liverpool have been been top. Because Liverpool have been top. None of their players have been in stinkers. It's not possible. Now they're like, oh, Cody Gakpo. I'm not sure about him. Been saying this for months, but because the top of the league doesn't matter. Yeah, it's just what it's just not everybody has to be playing well, man. Learn football. Yeah, but oh, Mace, you can you could go. say the same for Mason Mount. What did Chelsea fans used to say? Oh, he's a manager's dream because he does bleak tests instead of score instead of winning his team football matches and, and slicing defenses. Chelsea fans used to say this stuff all the time. Oh my god, he's a manager's dream. He 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 pans out or he perfects tactical tactical um, instructions. He takes on instructions well. All of this rubbish, bro. Uh, and it's just makeshift for, oh, he works hard, but he's not really going to impact the game to, as well I'm as not, other players. I'm not here so, to shit on Mason Mount because I actually think he's a good player. I just think it was a stupid decision to go, yeah, but, Man, to, go to Man United. And I think it was a stupid decision for Man United to pay that kind of fee for him. So it's been a total disaster of a transfer. He has he has made impacts, but I get what you're saying. Yeah, I'm, think, not, I'm not even saying he's a bad player. I'm just saying he's just... I think not there's a comeback yeah. for Mason Mount somewhere. Yeah, I'm not sure. I mean, you would hope so. Oh, 60 million pounds, they better be. <laughs> they absolutely better be. Better He's be, not man. even made like 10 Premier League appearances for the club this season. There absolutely yeah. needs to be a comeback. Okay. Well, we signed Lavia with that money and we ain't seen him to the re- as, until next season now. So. Mm, I'm hearing your technical stuff. Drop the ball on that, that one. Average 60 million is looking mm. quite good, isn't it? No, no. it's not. It stinks. <laughs> no, don't do that. Bloody stinks. I've been a better signing for Arsenal than Manta has been for Man United. Yeah, yeah, well, yeah. Of course, because the standards are in the guard. Yeah, Man exactly. Played. I said it's looking a lot better, isn't it? Who's yeah, been a better? Who's been a better signing, Havertz or Nunes? Nah, come on, man. <laughs> yeah. Answer that one. <laughs> no agenda against Nunes. No one's got a problem with Nunes. <laughs> no, no, no. I'm, I'm, not, I'm not got an agenda. I'm asking. I'm not talking about Darwin Nunes. I'm talking about the other Nunes. I think, Nunes. I think Havertz yeah, yeah, yeah. impacted Arsenal oh. more than Nunes impacted City. Yo, okay. they, they say Nunes question mark. They don't even know who that brother mm. is. My, I, my, 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 my City could just do that. Yeah. That's, That's what I mean. That's what I mean. And when I speak on it, they'll say, Tobes, you're hating. I just said my answer. I think Havertz has been a better signing than Nunes. You, yeah, not you, you, not you. You, 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 you're fair with that one. I'm just saying. God damn. If I mention it, I'll get called a hater. Very, so. very, very violent behavior from you today. Very Let me violent. See what super Mad. None on the subject of. Tobes rude, man. Tobes is so rude. That one mimosa and he's acting the bollocks. What a guy. <laughs> 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 Shit, I need to stop making noise here. Sorry. <laughs> no, make noise, Tobes, make prediction, bro. Uh, I'm gonna go for a cheeky Desmond. 2-2. Two, 2-2, two. Two, two, Saeed. I'm going to go with... 3-1 mm, United. United. 3-1 United. United. I'm going to go 2-2 two, two as well. Matisse. 2-1 uh, Brentford. Fair ah, enough. Two. Fair enough. Yeah, I respect it, man. Yeah, why not? Yeah. Flipping on, yeah, violence. Yes, I love it. I love it. I'm gonna say 2 0 Man United and Grizz 1 1. 
So we've got three mm-hmm. goals on there, one Brentford win and a couple of United wins. We'll publish on the socials. No super chats. We'll move straight on to Chelsea, Burnley, Matisse. Yeah. Uh, yeah. He's, he's saying Chelsea, I'm about to order an Indian. That's kind of where my priority is right now. Do you know what I mean? Like, we're just trying to make sure that we get some food. Chelsea, listen, we've got more injuries. <laughs> Uh, we got more injuries, man. Press conference today. It's telling us that. Right, man. Big up, man. How was it? How was it? Was it? Oh. How was the atmosphere in there? Nah, it's too much rain, man. Rain kind of killed the vibe. I just went to go and see Cold Palmer and, and go home. Yeah, man. Saying? Speak on it, my guy. Yeah, speak on it, man. Tell us. It was not not everybody was there because international break, so they're coming back late. So oh. um, they come back late. So there's oh. no Enzo. There's loads of no Madueke as well. It was only about. Maybe 11, 12, a very light session. Uh, Poch was nowhere to be seen. I couldn't find this man. Don't know where he went. So, but yeah, loads of injuries again. People that we thought were back are now gone again. Very boring, very annoying. Who else? So, so Lavi is injured. So, so Lavi is new the rest that, of the season. Chukwemeko, who, who had a good game against Leicester when he came on and scored. I was looking forward to seeing him again. He's now out again, rehabilitation. For how long? I don't know. They don't tell us. They just say rehabilitation. They, that's their favourite word. Um, <laughs> Chil- Chilwell was playing two games for England. Now he's not not sure if he can touch and go whether he can play now, which is nice. Thanks, a bless- that's a blessing in, in disguise for you guys. Yeah, you, you say that, but then Kukurea could have could have a moment as well. So you never know. Like The two left-backs are... Kukurea, Huk- Huk- yeah? Oh, stop that! Um, Don't start that business. Okay, wow, wow. Okay, oh, Toby. Wow. Cu- cu- what were they calling him on Twitter? Cucciarella. <laughs> I call him my cocaine crackhead. That's what I call him. Stop, man. Stop. Can I get onto more pressing matters? Go on, yeah, go on. Like, oh, sorry. I, I, you know, big up you and everything. And injuries, yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah very yeah, sympathetic yeah. of the injuries. Yeah, go yeah, on. yeah. Yeah, find that. But, <laughs> so today we hear we hear, today we're hearing Todd Bowley is going to be replaced. Mm. Uh, it's not really new information. Yeah. It's not yeah. even new. It's not really even new information to be honest. Like this where, was already this was already this, told what's, to us. The, the so chairmen are going to be rotating. So God Sounds knows why that plan. needs to happen. Sounds yeah, like a good plan. Yeah, don't know why that's going on. Um, they make twenty million a year, I believe, as a chairman. So they're wow. going to be rotating. Um, so who who will be next? Maybe Egbali. I don't know. Maybe it will be um, Vissa. Viss, what's his name? The old brother, the Swiss brother. Um, yeah, who? It could be anyone. Anyone. Anyone could be chairman. I don't know. I have no idea what's going on. Um, anyone in terms of who's chairman. next? But in 2027, that's when his chairman deal expires. Um, which is interesting. Um, I don't remember us rotating chairmans previously. He's but it's chairman. something new. <laughs> yeah, the, the chairman's deal is expiring. Yeah, I mean, when did he sign the deal? Uh, 2023 is it? That's, yeah, so that'll be that'll be four year deal. So yeah, man. But yeah, I don't care. I, I I don't I don't even care because now I'm just I'm I'm again. I just need to, I just need the season to end, Grizz. You see all this shenanigans every day. Yeah. Injuries, this chairman, that you know. Don't you this want deal. swimming football? Huh? Yeah, I'm, 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 I'm getting into it. Yeah, I'm really getting into it now. The, I want the women's team to the win proper, the Champions the League. The only problem is, is Emma Hayes yeah, is leaving. Is I love Emma Hayes, man. Emma Hayes was the one that was going to gravitate me to that team the most, and and she's leaving. That's the best. That's you the biggest personality. You might as well come and talk about them every week because I'm tired of your men's team, man. <laughs> I hear that. I'm, 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 I'm tired as well. Yeah, well, every, everyone's tired. Um, no, but, no, but at I, least I, Lauren I, James. At least Lauren James plays ten games in a row. Like. Well, might as well move over there and yeah. no, but, no, but guys, do you know when to, you know when Matisse says he just wants this season to end, right? And I get it. Man's fatigued. Very yeah? tired. Yeah. Man's fatigued, man. Yeah. Fatigued. Mm. Um, long season. Long season, brother. Yeah. Back to back long but season. Pedri Pedri thing. It couldn't right. happen to a, it couldn't right. happen to a better but man. Tobes, but Tobes, do you not think I actually think it's gonna be a longer season next season as well? I oh, think this lovely. is it. And I've said it for a little while. I think they're gonna get. I think this is their level now. Nah, like, man. I think I, f- I. don't think it's gonna get worse mm, next season. See, this is where you lose me. Before you I don't said, think it's gonna get worse. This is where season, you've been I inconsistent. Mind. I want you to clarify today and make it confirmed as a as a as a Grizz. No, sorry, as a football carnage um, official statement because you said it's gonna click eventually. There's so much quality in this team. It's gonna click eventually. I remember that you've been saying that. That's your very line. At your very start. statement. So are you done with that now? It's not clicking. Sure. It's not so going to click. So when you presented, how many times have we said when we presented with evidence? Yes. So at the start, I said, "Nah, too much quality, man." 
in this team. Uh -huh. We are presented with a whole season now, pretty much, 10 games to go with evidence. And also, so it's not going to click. And also, I tweeted something a couple of weeks ago and, and people would get on my case where I said, I've been told by people that work in the industry that Chelsea will get bludgeoned with some charges and some of them will probably result in points deduction. And when you hear all of this and then you hear about the financial situation it's gone back, like, man. It's gone and back. you hear about Shut musical it, chairs you. Yeah. <laughs> and you hear about musical chairs with your chairman. <laughs> if you're playing really musical not. chairs with your chairman, where does that leave the coach? The whole structure seems to be crumbling. We know the finances ain't financing. Humble crumble. Players, you know, a lot of young players mm. you can't see you going into the market. Apparently you have to raise 120 million by the 30th of June. Uh or you're going to be in big trouble. Now, how do you raise that 120 million? Everyone's saying, oh, we're going to sell this. We're going to sell this. We're going to sell this. Buying clubs know exactly what the status quo is of Chelsea. I just think there's a lot of troubled times ahead. I still think there's quality in the in the squad. I'm not going to deny that suddenly. I don't think Moises Caicedo is suddenly a bad player. I don't think Enzo Fernandez is a bad player. I think they're both brilliant players, in my opinion. Cold Palmer, we know. Mm. I just think... I just think the whole club in itself is in big, big trouble, man. Big trouble. Uh, is Robert here? Robert? <laughs> no, he don't want Robert, to stand up. Robert, no. rise. No. Rise, no, Robert. Are you? Are you? If you are here, are you, Robert. Robert? Wait, wait. Robert, where are you? Mr. Mugabe, where are you? <laughs> no, he don't want to know today. He don't want to know today. Yeah, I mean, like I said, this is all very stressful times. Big headache. I'm trying to get a samosa, so I'm not really in the... <laughs> <laughs> um, I'm, I'm, I, I don't really have much to say about that that speculation nah, hey. that you've just said. Yeah, we. I mean, you see, the thing is with me. If I if I, if I start stressing myself out about that, then it uh, it's long. Uh, let me just wait for the breaking news. You know, the the Ornstein bomber at the end of the season. Whenever they decide this penalise will happen or it won't happen, then breaking news and I'll go live and cry. Then and until then, there's no point. So yeah, there's there's ninety nine problems and and this one game. Let's see if we can. Just get through it and and just move on to the next. It's a, it's a home game to Burnley. If we can't beat Burnley at home, with how they've been this season, how open they are, then um, yeah, just shut it all down. So I'm confident with the with this game in isolation. I'll say that. Let's bring the super chats in. Ad reacts says Bon Matisse and his emergency meetings. May your sorrow continue. You light skin Stevie Wonder. Mad. <laughs> right, he actually. Yeah. Flipped. Um, Siren says Matisse next season we go up the Chels by the way did you ask Raz why he's not passing big fan of the show love from Brooklyn nah I didn't even it was pissing down with rain I just went to see my faves and then dipped <laughs> can't lie I didn't even speak to, to Raz it was, it was when I'm telling you it was bucketing down with rain I said bro I'm gonna grab a couple pictures I took a picture of Cole Palmer Tiago Silva and um, Jackson baby Jesus those are my investments and obviously respect to the mm. legend because he's leaving at the end of the season. I, I got my investments and I went, yeah, we just went. And, and Gusto as well, we saw quickly. I had to tell him he's a baller and go, yeah, yeah. That's it. That's no it. More. Place says, Matisse, why don't you do the all you t all you can, all you talk Chelsea like Saeed does man them talk? Where are the opposition views? It's like watching four mantises. Paul Matisse's, I guess. No disagreements. No, nah, he doesn't mean Matisse's. I don't know what he's saying. There is plenty of disagreements, actually, because Eunice wanted Jose Mourinho. I didn't. But, you know, last couple of weeks, there hasn't. It's a show. That's just how shows operate. Do you know what I mean? Some, we're not going to force... There's Robert. There's Robert. We're not going to force disagreements just, just to force it. And then when we disagree, um, then people cuss anyway because they'll be like, oh... You know, your opinion da, 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 stinks. You're paid by the club, sitting on the fence. So I don't really, I don't really want mine too also, much. Also, man, them talks on steroids, man. You can't, it's hard to get a show like man, them talk. I'm not, I'm, I'm, not, listen, I'm not, I don't, I don't have the fitness for man, them talk. Man, them talk is its own thing. We will not make a Chelsea version of that. I don't know how Saeed does it. I'm not, I'm not running that. You have to ask someone else to run that. That's, that's mad. Man, them talk is, is way too is, much. It's mad. It's mad. Yeah, no. Mm -hmm. It's very mad. I can literally feel the yeah. energy it's very like, bad. draining. Yeah, that's mad. I'm sorry. That's mad. <laughs> I big up, man.
You're a big Robert, man. Yeah. Robert, lift your head up. Yo, Matisse, I think you need to do like a one on one with Robert, you know, just just for the fans. Maybe Drop put that it. on a big put that on a big six channel. Do a Discord Discord one on one with Robert, you know. Yeah. Discord one on one. Contents. Robert would have been yeah. great for uh, the video we did last week in Shoreditch. Robert ain't yeah, even a member, man. Yeah, Robert's Robert's got to pull up to the thing in person. Oh no, he's in, is he in America? He's in the he's in America, bro. Yeah, Rob, Robert yeah. might be at the preseason. Where are Maybe you? Take where are you guys America? playing preseason? Uh, we're in America. Yeah, yeah, we're in America. yeah where? Where? Oh, where? Ah, oh, man, everywhere. Atalanta, everywhere, man. They're doing all. Did the you just say speed. Atalanta? Yeah, Atalanta. Yeah. Atlanta, Atlanta, yeah, Atlanta. Atlanta. Taking the piss. No, no, we're, no, we're playing Atlanta, Atlanta Georgia. Atlanta, Georgia. We're Atlanta, Georgia, Atlanta, Georgia man. Europa. Atlanta, Georgia. <laughs> Atlanta, Georgia. Um, Atlanta, yeah. you know, Atlanta, Atlanta, Georgia, man. That was the last one on Chelsea. I've got 11 Super Chats left that I'm going to get into. No more Super Chats, people, because we're going to do the Chelsea predictions. Get those 11 in and keep it moving to the end of the show. Tobes, Chelsea, Burnley. Um, I'm gonna go for three one, man. Three one, three one. Said, uh, Chelsea three nil. I'm gonna go. I'm gonna go two nil. Matisse. Um, I'll go three nil as well. Hugh? I got 2 0 Chelsea. And Grizz. I'm going to say 3 1. Cool. Couple 3 1s from Grizz and Tobes. Couple 3 0s from Matisse and Saeed. A couple 2 0s from myself and Hugh. That rounds off predictions. We'll publish those tomorrow on the socials. Robert says he'll be in Cali. What? Chelsea are in Cali pre season as well? Maybe they Ooh. are. Yeah. I think we are as well. There's a few of us there. Is awesome. there some sort, yeah. of League, there some sort of Premier League tournament going on again? Yeah, uh, big one. Need to look into that. We might need to look into that. Um, but we will. We will. Robert, I should see you there. Hopefully, we see you there. Um, like I said, let me go back to the Super Chats. Starting at the top, Levi says, Spurs, William Gallas, really, Saeed. Alden Embarrassing, Barrow, honestly. Alden Barrow, Bro, Vanden I'm Vanden sorry, Vanden I'm sorry, man. Danny Rose is just as brazy, though. But a lot of people, though. A lot of people are just looking at that one, one like you know, what I mean, play. I know it's a lot, but I just had a moment there, man. But that's the pressure of the game, though. You've got to think on the spot, so. But the rest of my team is cold. Nobody could deny that. But the rest of my team I, 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 we, is sensational. Can deny it. Can deny it. What? It's definitely no, no, no. deniable. Hmm. How did? Yeah, that was wild. <laughs> no, you know. How did you end up with him? Fuck. Bro, see, listen to me. How did you end up with Rose? There was no air condition. No, Danny, 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 was this was the thing. Said, Danny Rose. Rose, Danny Rose was a very solid left back for Tottenham under Poch. He was. I don't get this disrespect. I think you guys was, are just doing too much. Maybe because he, he doesn't have a fancy this, this name. Is, but this is a, this is a Premier League all time combined. Yeah, exactly. but so. yeah, but okay. So what left back would you have put in then with my with my clubs left? Yeah, what clubs did you have left? No, I think Danny Rose was cold for Spurs. Yeah. I was just saying, Saeed. I want to say forget about Danny. For Spurs. I couldn't put Aspi because I didn't have any more Chelsea players. He left. was he, he was cold for us. What do you mean? You he was like, cold yeah, for us. Danny Rose was solid. Yeah, yeah, for he, was, he, was, he was cold for Tottenham. Very, yeah, very, very solid. Girl, I, I didn't have I didn't have Arsenal picks left. That's what I'm saying. Oh, okay. Yeah, you said a doggy. That's that's what I'm saying, man. I just a doggy. Fuck. <laughs> it's a doggy, isn't it? A doggy. Okay, man. It's yeah, all subjective. Doggy. People, go watch the draft video. It came out earlier today. So this one, this show is going to be done in about five, ten minutes, Max. You can go over there if you if you've got some time and watch that. No, no, no. Please. Joking aside, yeah, I'm going to watch that. Aside, yeah, yeah. No, no. Tobes. Joking aside, this is going to sound so cringe, but I'm going to say it. I swear to you, it's, it's one of our best, best shows. I think it's a wicked show. People need to go and check out yeah. the, the draft that we've done because everyone does drafts, yeah. But I thought the way we on the spot, we didn't give each other time. We put pressure on each other. I think it's a fantastic, fantastic show. But yeah. I'll let you be the judge. I'm going to watch yeah. that. Um, I'm going to watch that after this. Yeah, it was. Big up big up the, the editing team as well. Um, always, was, always. Uh, always, um, always. Big up the editing team. Blue Flag says, how to join the Discord server? I've been trying for two weeks and it's been disappointing. Can the mod give some link? Blue Flag. So, I've... 
I found some trouble joining it as well. Have you linked your YouTube channel? Because that's what sorted it for me. Once you open up the Discord, you go into settings and then you have an option to link an account. Go over to your YouTube channel because obviously you're a member through YouTube. So if you link up your YouTube channel, that will allow you to then send messages in the server that we run. If you need the link for the server we run, then it should be in the community. If it's not, then I'll put it in the community post this stream. Um, but if you are in the server and you're, you're, you're failing to get messages across, that's because the YouTube account hasn't been linked. So give that a go. Um, and when I put in a community post, the Discord link, if anything, it, it, you can use that as a troubleshooting platform in the comment section. Let us know what, what problems you're facing, if any, and we can help you sort it out. Big up. I see a, a couple of people saying the, the draft was fire. I've just put the this well i say i scars just put the discord link in the chat as well so you can see it right there just click that and the instructions are there as well but like i said troubleshoot if you need aquil says was a pleasure to meet you all genuine dudes you make it mad difficult for me to hate on your smelly teams too much love for you all big up come on come on it was a pleasure for us to you know me. Oh, that's it's the brother that brought. Uh, that, that's the brother that brought science to the debate, but I didn't hear him mention anything. Ah, uh, kill. Yeah, 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 yeah. He was yeah, science, yeah. And, and he ended with the Lord. <laughs> <laughs> you know what it is, yeah. You, Grizz just said he watched the draft video, and he said that's our best piece of content. I can't even lie to you. How I felt after that meet up last Friday, it felt like that that will be our best piece of content, and that will be the best you know series mm. we have moving forward there was just something about it did this this show has been built on the community and the community showed out so hopefully you know that keeps on happening hopefully you know the city show out and hopefully we can keep on delivering because yeah that sort of content is exactly what we're here for something different something for the community something that bangs ah oh, shit costa I imagine i removed your super chat i didn't even read it it's all mad costa apologies i've lost it now Emmanuel says, big up guys from Chicago at the point in the season, I'd rather play a mid-table team than a team fighting for something. I'd say 3-1 to Arsenal. Yeah, goes without saying. No disrespect to Manu, but Liverpool's the only club where the English media don't gas up young stars. England caps after 10 good games for United. Mm -hmm. Big up Grizz. Shows what the England team is. We got Grizz and all 4.30 in the morning in India and I'll gift 60 memberships if you all leave Grizz from forfeit and Saeed, see you on April the 7th. We will be there. I deny your application yeah. and your request. Oh, love for the super chat. What do you mean, man? What do we do? Yo, didn't even flinch. No 60, you know, it didn't even flinch. Brothers, we need to talk. Wow, Business 60 memberships. That's, Toby, awesome. Huey, big, Saeed, that's a big Matisse. amount of people. The business is business, people. 60 wow. memberships going in. Well, I'm just thinking that's that's 60, 60 extra man them in the Discord hopping for this title race as well. It's a weird number. If he runs it up to 100, then we can talk. But 60, wow. Yeah. Wow. 60 is in limbo, wow. man. 60 is just there. Who says 60? Mm. Who says 60? Man, it's crazy, man. LFC my bribing it. What's going on here? My life means this much to you, look. <laughs> <laughs> that's I'm some crazy humbled. bribery, though. That's, that's some football humbled. carnage. A uh, trooper right there, like that's someone he's riding oh, he up. Is. Yeah, 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 yeah. He's a calling, uh, calling yeah. icon. He's trying to spare your life. He's always He's always trying to spare your life. Wow. What, what did I miss? Sorry. Man's offering sixty memberships to our subscribers, viewers, if mm. I be allowed the forfeit. Wow. Wow. No, no, no. He's no, not no, no. Nah, uh, nah. Don't 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 lose nah. your morals, people. Don't, nah. you know, wow. the nah. Man City, you know, Man City, you know, no, big no, Man no, City no, saying, no. "Don't lose your morals." You must. <laughs> yeah, you, man. You, he's got to stop. I must stop for myself. Nah, that's crazy. You must do that for it. Man, if, 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 need be, if need be, we'll pull we'll pull money together and we'll pay for the sixty memberships just so you have to do the the, the forfeit. Exactly. Yeah. We'll we'll, 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 yeah, we'll double that forfeit. We'll double that. I'm definitely not drunk. I'm I'm so sober. 
Get off the show. Bale. You're drunk. Bale is set at 100 memberships. Bale is set at 100 memberships. If you want Bale. to do that. Man's Bale. Bale. Me out. <laughs> Yo, people, where's my people? <laughs> Are we setting the precedent here? Are we setting the precedent here? We're setting the precedent here. Nah, people, people this is crazy. Oh, should, nah, we're, no we're not doing bills. this. There should be no bail because then someone's going to be crazy bills. enough to pay. 75 memberships, go on. Nah, but Bale, Bale means he's just out on, on tag, man. We'll bring him back in for some nonsense. <laughs> <laughs> Suspended. <laughs> That's crazy. That's you so know, it's. I think. I think Grizz. I think we're now entering April, right? So Grizz can feel the walls closing in because he's like, "Wow, I, I really only have like seven <laughs> oh, but weeks." But I'm dead. We mean walls closing in. I can't see <laughs> shit. <laughs> that brother is dead. You know, total darkness, man. I'm just. Saying, you know how Matisse was dead. You know, like a couple of months yeah. back. You yeah. Know? That's Finish me that. right now, man, in terms of the prediction table. Yeah. Just want wow. Nick says, just wanted to say thank you for making my life better. Watched every single show since the end of 2020. Love to every one of you. Big up from Hamburg. Nick, love for the love, man. Really appreciate it. How far is Hamburg from Dortmund? Because I'm definitely going to be in Dortmund for the Euros. So if it's close enough, maybe we link up. But yeah, if not enjoy love for the support and and you know maybe one day we're in germany to do one of the back your chat episodes hopefully it grows to that level perry hope you're good my brother he says big up the lads it was a pleasure meeting you all in london you're all really nice guys and and humble gentlemen the best show on youtube hands down thank you big very up perry man big up perry we appreciate it perry thank you for dropping in um oh LFT says 100 no oh. problem it's turned to 115. I'm sorry. No, just no, 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 no. It's 115. But, sorry, the chat said that it makes sense. Get out, get out. I'm going. I'm going. If you fuck around. No, 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 brother. No, 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 no. I like 115. 115. It's a bro. The man said 100. 100. 150. Are you not seriously doing wow. this? this is yes, we are. Violation. You called his bluff, oh, you know. You no, called I can't be calling him. Turkish, 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 jack it up to a thousand. Yo, get him off the screen, man. Admin, where's admin? Fuck him off, man. He's pissing me off. Man. Money, money isn't everything, man. Come on, man. No, 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 no. Oh, I'm not doing that for money. Oh, you can't be bluffing the subscribers like that, man. Loyal subscribers, man. Putting up We're not even bluffing, man. I, I want it to be so high that no, I want it to be so high that no subscriber, memberships. no subscriber does it because we don't want you to to skip out of your forfeit. It's simple. Mm. We stand on business. Yeah, you, and you got to stand on your forfeit. You should stand and on you, business and, and, and you're going to stand forfeit. on the roadside. <laughs> Imagine, bro, Chris, you in a high vis just stop in the middle of nah, bro. I don't nah, bro. Listen, you're going to be on Piers Morgan on the you know That's you know where you're going to be. You know what? Do you know why I'm confused? You know why I'm confused? It's because you did say 100 in his bail. And Oi, like, bro, you kind of have to. You can't man of his word guy. now, like no, like no, 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 nah, not no. for me, man. Oh, there's, no, there's, there's, no, there's no, there's no, honor amongst thieves, man. No, no, uh, no, 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 no. Shut up, Robin. No, man. What are you talking no, about? no, no. <laughs> no. I'm no with Toby. I'm with Toby. No, I'm with Toby. You're an idiot as well. That's why. And I'm an idiot. <laughs> yeah, you man don't know bail just means until the trial. That's all it means. So if bail's set at hundred and uh, hundred comes in, the trial's still coming. He just gets to enjoy his life in the meantime. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Wording, man. It's all key. It's all key. <laughs> Yo, don't send in that membership, you know. You might get flogged. This is unbelievable, man. I can't believe you look. This is unbelievable. Wow. You can hold that, man. You're a big boy. You're a big boy. You're a big boy. Chris. <laughs> Saeed. Big dog, you know, you are a big dog to be fair. You did say that. The Grizz, Saeed, and Tobes, I must say, on and off camera, you lot are real G. Pleasure meeting you lot for the first time. Kirks, Matisse, and Hugh, I've seen you guys more than once. So you already know it's all respect. Always, Ryan. Big up, Big up bro. Big up, man. Amarion says, given Ten Hag's setup with Dalot inverting, Mainu Mount Bruno is the best midfield we can put out. It's not perfect, but it's better than having Casemiro. Fucking hell. Times have changed. Oh, Marion, yeah. man. Crazy. RAK says, it's my birthday on 1st of April. I'm turning 25. Not, I'm not asking too much, but it'd be great if you all could acknowledge, acknowledge that. Bro, happy birthday, my boy. Happy you birthday, bro. Let us know when it 
when it's time on Monday show. But we'll remember. I'll actually remember. Oh, come on, man. I'll raise you. Come on. You're we'll be there, innit? Yeah, we'll be there. You're, you're, you're always Saeed, man. showing love, Send man. Send another one, Gunning Saeed, man. I'll sing happy birthday for you, bro. Just Gun Saeed for me a bit more. <laughs> okay. But you're your getting the forfeit, so hold that. Listen, I'm, I'm, that's it. I'm going to hold against all of you, look, man. 100 memberships. What are you saying? I don't get it. <laughs> um, <laughs> uh, we've moved. <laughs> R.A.K. in shock. Oh, I say enjoy, but we'll talk on Monday. Chris is in shock. Um, I will do 50 on April the 7th before if you want. step. Listen, step into my office, LFC, say the DMs are open. Negotiations are there. 115 is bail. Trial is still set. Bail gives you a hope that you might have helped your friend, but you know, I can't promise that. Come trial, well, Harley, he, could get, he could get a lesser do. sentence, he could, he, he could sit on a side road rather than a main road. <laughs> okay, now something, no, 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 why not? Why not? We'll talk. We'll talk. You know what? Robert. I think that could be a play. Just to add, yeah, that could be a play. We could have had you in rush hour. Now we're going to take you into off-peak hours. That, that <laughs> could be a play. Yeah, can I go? Can yeah, I go and yeah, do yeah it? that's a good one. Can I go and do it at the Matisse roundabout? Can I go and do it at the roundabout? <laughs> There's literally nothing there. You know that. Nothing. <laughs> 5 a.m. No one's there, man. Hey, Robert. Buzzer beater. Matisse, your doom and gloom about Chelsea's too much, fam. Cheer up. Don't let Grizz bash us like that and you don't say nothing. We've got ballers and a bad coach. That's it. Oh, I just, I don't Limit, know what to Limit. say. Limit. I don't know what Limit. to say. I just, my, my, the fan base is so tiring because you, they, you there is no it. solution to this problem and the only solution is results. You guys can tell me as much as you want that, you know, it's not that bad or, you know, we're here and we're going to be fine or, you know, we need to balance out this this panel. And listen, we lose two more games. You same people are going to be pulling hair out. Same way. So it's like, just okay. let's just all just not talk about Chelsea anymore until the, until next season. How about that? Let's just not talk. Okay. <laughs> let's just not talk. Because we know right. where it is. We're, we're, we're 11th. What, what are we doing? What are we doing? Look at me on this panel. 11th. They're having conversations about... Different, different little topics here and there. I can't even get involved. You're telling me, calm down, bro. It's crazy. Just, just, yeah, just leave it, man. Just, just, let's just park it. Park it till next season, please. And yes. I beg of I you. Have, I have seen it, people. I have seen it. I thought it's better to end on it rather than Roberts. Big up, Paul. He says, boys, keep producing the 1010 content. I've missed the last few shows, but saw the last Friday live show earlier today. Superb. Dropped you a little something to support you, brothers. God bless. Paul. Thank you. Appreciate the donation. It goes back into the brand, the business, the content. Um, just a reminder for everyone out there, as well as the memberships and, you know, showing love to the sponsors as well. So thank you for the super chat. Thank you for the words. Hopefully you can make it to one of the link ups one day. Um, because it was a pleasure seeing a lot of the supporters out there. And we're going to try, you know, get this UK wide and hopefully global um, because it was you know, it was good. It was good. And I'm sure you'll agree when it comes out. All right. Predictions made. Topics discussed. Super chats done. Just a reminder, people. Opta, the new sponsor on board. Show them some love, people. A few games there. There's a link in the live chat. Opta 5 is the one we're focusing on. We're going to be running through that week in, week out. It's linked to the prediction table. Five points up for grabs. Five points lost also up for grabs. So come the end of the season, it can, be, it can go a long way in deciding what happens in the prediction table, including the forfeit. But it's Opta. It's free. It's not betting. You just play a game. You can win cash. You should support the big six. It makes sense, people. And before I wrap up, I just want to put this in the live chat. Big up. It's hard to say this, at, but at Hayo Midi. Hopefully I got that right. That's an Instagram account because you are the winner of the Manscaped um, competition that we run on last Monday's show about 12 days ago. Now, remember I said, if you grab something off Manscaped, I'll send you this messy shirt as well, brand new with tags from the League's Cup last year. He was top scorer. They won it. It'll be worth something in a few years. Um, and it's a fucking nice shirt, to be honest with you. So, yeah, big up high your midi. I'm going to message you on Instagram. Um, and big up everyone that took part. Obviously, showed love, sent the receipts. We do Who won it? Who won it? Say that name again. Smith, let me search it. You know, you know Instagram handles are... T-A-R-M-I-Z-Z-Y? No, no, no. 
لا 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 او تامزي اعطيه ست اتش اي اتش اي ار واي او ار ام اي دي يا يا سلون لا لا اي اي سين ذا يا دو ما بقى كونفاين ات ناو بقى Yeah, why, so why do you care? So mad. What did you apply or something? Chris <laughs> <laughs> apply. Chris <laughs> apply. I am midday. I am Must be Nigerian. I am midday. You're the winner, my guy. You're the winner. Chris apply. Um, Imagine. <laughs> I'm gonna mess you. I got bird right. accounts, you know. Right now. I'm saying nothing, but why are you like switching on me? Um, Grizz, Grizz is blind, you just you just see Grizz turn up in a messy top next show. <laughs> <laughs> you wouldn't put it past me. Don't go anywhere. <laughs> Don't go anywhere. Oh, sorry. Someone said they want that legendary yellow old too long. See, I am selling a few Arsenal shirts as well, people. But message me privately about that because I've got too much here, and I'm trying to stock up on the XL and get rid of the larges. So if you're a large. Let me know, people, if you're interested in anything. Oh, is that, is that the Omri black gloves, yeah? That one? Yeah, that's the Bernabeu. Mm, oh, shh. Bernabeu, Bernabeu, mm. Bernabeu. Oh, shit. Let's wrap shit. it up. Let's wrap it up. I haven't even clocked this two and a half hours because it's been so long. It's flown by Hugh, um, Saeed, Grizz, Matisse, and Tobes, whatever he's doing. Hopefully, you're all... Um, hopefully, you all enjoy the weekend, aside from Hugh. And um, we'll be back on Monday to talk about the results. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know why I was saying everyone's name. That's it. Link in the description, all of that. I fucking lost it two weeks out. Here we are. Um, we are back on Monday night, people, 9 p.m. Schedule will come out. There's a few late ones this month because there's a lot of games on Monday. There's a, there's a lot of games on Thursday in the Europa League. So look out for it. Half 10 p.m., 11 p.m. starts galore. You know, but there's a few 9 p.m.s in there as well for the people that can only do the early ones. Ah, right, hit the like button. Make sure you subscribe. Love for the love as always. And we're back on Monday. Peace.